What's up, VOD people? We're back with some KH Hundo Percent. <coughs> I also have the Persona Kahoot, that's right. It's not gonna carry a, a stream day, probably, but that'll be for a double feature. I just don't know where to put it at this point, because I, I can't uh, carry a whole stream with that one. Um, Kiwi's calling. Here comes Kiwi! Yo, Kiwi! Hey, babe. What's going on? <laughs> I wasn't ready for the babe. I wasn't ready, but I... And I'm just chilling. I always appreciate a good babe, you know. Oh, babe, yeah. it's a hundred floors of frights, babe. <laughs> <laughs> Beck Bennett. Look how much fucking MP I have, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I miss Beck. Wow, look at that bar. Yeah, look at that thick blue bar. Mm. It's pretty good. Um, what should I do, folks? You were Tim Pool, right? There's no way there was another Tim Pool on my coup. Yeah, yeah, it was Tim Pool. <laughs> what a fucking idiot. Got vodka. The Got vodka. Uh, the new place is nice. Oh yeah, I've seen it. It's fucking sick. It's uh, yeah, it's fucking sick, Brett. Yeah, fucking uh, sick, Brett. Yeah, it's mad cozy. It's mad cozy right there's, now. There's a supply shortage of furniture. I didn't know that. Um, uh, yeah, I, I just uh, I just stole all my furniture. Oh, nice. From like a corporation or from a person. Today. You stole three dollars? Yeah. I don't know why I asked that with the seriousness of like Willy Wonka questioning Charlie about fizzy lifting drinks. I was like, you stole three dollars? Good what? day! Good day, sir! <laughs> why, uh, how and why, if you uh, care to disclose that? Uh, I found three dollars on the floor and I took it. Oh, okay. Well, that's not stealing. That's finders keepers. See, I was walking because at work we're doing a step challenge. Whoever mm. takes the most steps in the next month wins cash. Oh. I already won cash, though, because while walking, I found $3 on the floor. I feel like that's so, yeah, counterintuitive that to a job where you're mostly sitting, right? Uh, that's the idea, actually. Oh, okay, gotcha. Well, I would think that they would want people sitting so that they would get their work done. <laughs> oh, no. It's not really that kind of place. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. See, I don't it's know kind of like a, you know, we could do like maybe half of the day of working and the other right. half we're just going to fuck around. Mm. Yeah. Very like man bun, crunchy granola kind of place. Yeah. Yeah, that's <laughs> the one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> gotcha. Um, all right. I can send this. I can send this. Um, what do you think Mystery Goo is, Kiwi? Uh, you know what? You, yeah, you don't have to answer that. Question, you don't right? have to answer that. It's okay. If you'd like yeah, to, you I'm can. I'm probably not the person you want to ask. Okay. I gotta find that could go anywhere with, mystery with goo Wade. expert. Yeah, you're right. Um, the synthesis shop is so cool. Like, this fucking machine. This is like the young, younger cousin of the uh, World Terminus machine. Like, what does that? What does that meter measure? Isn't that like a? Uh, that's a pride flag right there, is it not? I need a. Mm. Uh, I need some of our experts in chat, aka literally all of you, to uh, tell me. What is that? Just applesauce. Is that applesauce in the furnace? Man, I can go with some fucking applesauce. The, me the meter measures couponess. Yeah, it's probably pretty close. Gayness, the gay meter. I guess we're at like a mid gay level right now. They have a mid gay situation. It's a code salmon. Um, closest to the lesbian flag. Yeah, I can see that. Um. There you go. Um, what should we do, Kiwi? What should we do? Oh. Friend. Yeah. Cap! cap oh, cap, right, of course. Cap, uh, cap, uh, yeah. cap, <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> I have to do, uh... I have to do solo, um... I need to do solo Hades, and I have to do Hercules time trial. So... Cap! 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 We do have to do Jungle Slider at some point, too, yeah. I want to send a special hello shout out to Ali today. Oh, okay. That's my special shout out person. Nice. He's getting a specific hello. Hello. Um, hello. You can run a prediction, Baka, for sure. Um, Hades time trial I can't even do yet. So it's either I do, I do Hercules time trial or Hades solo. I think I'm probably better off trying Hades solo. Yeah. Um. Let me look at my customs, though. Okay. I can at still... At this point, Barnabas... Oh, sorry. Go right. ahead. I was just going to say, at this point, um, it'll let me choose the seeds, so I only have to get through 10 at a time. Ooh, there's a Herc fight glitch. That's right. Maybe I will use it. 
Um, I don't know, Vodka. You're going to predict my death, I guess, right? How many deaths until Pat completes the Hades Cup solo? And then you just kind of do the same thing you did with Kurt Zisa, I suppose. Um, but I'm not going to die on this battle, so I'll let you get that set up while I thunder these bitches. Boom! Boom! Fucking nothing. They're ashes now. Got him. Boot up our 3DSs and play calm against each other? I don't think <laughs> that's how that I works. Have a 3DS. As if you could play calm on a 3DS. Thunder. As Can if you? I have a 3DS. As if I had a heart. Is that even a thing? I had a heart. Could you buy calm on 3DS somehow? Does Nintendo even support the 3DS anymore? Like, do they. God, I really have no physical strength, both IRL and as Sora. Um. Yeah, yeah, Phil does call you a lumpy little bitch <laughs> if you back out of the cup. Yeah, the con the you were like two two generations uh, ahead with the. Uh, but I would have loved to play Com on on a 3DS. It'd be a whole different experience. Oh, oh. So uh, you were saying Kenobi's a seven out of ten, huh? Yeah, yeah, it's a seven out of ten as of now. As of now. I feel like the people uh, were giving you shit. Well, someone said it was a two out of ten. Yeah, I, I don't know about that. That seems hyperbolic. Uh, yeah, I'd say so. I mean, I would say that you know you could probably place it at like a, a four to a nine out of ten, and I would pretty much be like, yeah, that that could be right. Yeah. You'll you'll buy a four out of ten for that. I'd buy a four, yeah. Okay, but you wouldn't buy it. There's a... definitely some like. There was definitely some stuff that happened in this most recent episode where I thought, like, ah, oh, that's a little dumb. Mm -hmm. That's a little dumb. A little um, bit dumb. But, uh, yeah, I mean, nothing that's gonna sink it to, you know, bad levels for me. So. Okay, that's good. Um, but, but, yeah, you can play Calm on the original DS because the DS had a, a GBA slot, a GBA hole. Ooh! Yeah! Daddy. In fact, I've done it before. Daddy I've done chill. it in the GBA hole. It's easy. Should I uh, juggle the trouble? Minute. How did this happen? We're smarter than this. What is this? What is this a reference to? <laughs> That's Kenobi in Revenge of the Sith. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. How did this happen? We're smarter than this. No worries, drink the jungle wine. They're also, why are you strife? Hello. Also, hello, allow. Jedi are fucking stupid. Are they? They're really dumb. Oh, we got the, the prediction up. If you'd like to predict how many times I'll die before I defeat the Hades Cup. Um, actually, what does this say? How many tries until Pat cheats and win? That's going to confuse people, Vaka. Um, but yeah, you can vote 1 to 2, 3 to 4, 5 to 6, 7 to 8, 9 to 10, or more than 10. Hades Cup solo is what we're voting on. Bet some points. You can win them and... I don't, I don't know. Make me pet the presto forever if you want. Um, how do I close this now? It's too big. There we go. I have an impersonation request. Okay. Well, you have to redeem that with your points. You think the economy can just allow Kiwi coming on and requesting them for free? Yes. That uh, that shakes the bedrock of of the regular pad economy. I'm sure you have enough points to redeem an impression. I do, but I don't want to use. Them. Well, what are you gonna? What are you saving them up for, bro? I don't know. I'm just gonna like <laughs> just, the for, high. just for a rainy day. Um, <laughs> all right, gotcha. Kibbles and bits, the Thank bits you. and bites, the peas and carrots, <laughs> salt <bits> and pepper. <laughs> 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 Sir, Zemnis doing an impression of Sir Patrick Stewart saying salt and pepper. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Oh my god, off, Zemnis saying salt and pepper. That's fun. Salt and pepper. It's <laughs> really good stuff. Ah, push it. <laughs> push it real good. Push it. The push and pull. Lick it now. Lick it good. <laughs> Fuck. No, Yuffie, don't! Oh! Oh no! Oh no! You! Cable! It's broken! It's broken! <laughs> Stop it, Yuffie. Yo, you know what I was watching the other day? Mm. 
That video? <laughs> oh my god. I just wanted bagels. Oh, bagel guy. Yeah. So bagel good. Boss. Bagel boss. Boy, dude. <laughs> he was hospitalized. Remember? Yep. We looked him up. Yep. We were like, oh, he almost died. Yep. I saw that too. Whew. I just wanted bagels. I'm so weak because I, I poured everything into MP and none of it into strength. In fact, I have something that puts my strength down. Jabi! <clears throat> Oh um, my god. Do I know any Xehanort speeches offhand? Not really. What's even like what's the big Xehanort speech? Probably like the cage three ending, right? A purge. The one where he starts busting out the capital W world. It's probably the biggest Xehanort speech. Why is that a step challenge? Oh yeah. Is that my fucking feet are on fire right now. Oh yeah. How many steps did you walk my, today? I got over ten thousand on my stroll today. Oh my god. Over nine thousand. Over nine thousand. Uh, well, yo, I am fucking cooking my coworkers right now. Oh, good, good. <laughs> yeah, I am smashing them. What is the prize? Like a gift card? Cash. Oh, cash. Yeah, that's good. I don't know how that's working, but even if there's no prize, I still want to win. Yeah, that's fair. I want to win! Yeah, I want to win, I want to win. <laughs> I got the guy! I got the guy. <laughs> I got the guy. No, 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 Um, it's Guy Fury Behemoth. Oh no! Do you have a favorite Behemoth uh, color swap thing? I kind of like uh, this one. <laughs> probably this one, actually. Yeah, it's really fun. I know it's doofy, but... Like, I don't know why he's, like, a Harley Davidson representative, but... Um... He looks like a sticker you put on your Guitar Hero controller. Oh yeah, look at those green nails. Does he have green nails? He does, oh my god. They're like green back nails. For his bankles. His back ankles. Oh, I disrupted it that easily, huh? Um, I might need to pop an elixir because I do no damage. Yeah, I will. Oh, Fuck God it. Vodka asks what I'm gonna spend my winnings on. Ooh. What will you spend your winnings Big on? Big question. Big mm. question. Oh, Weed. Uh, Weed. <laughs> That's fair. Oh, this is doing work. Key weed. Strictly medicinal, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Kiwid. Behemoth should have a tail. Yeah, I feel like a little bit of a tail for the behemoth would be nice. Fruit cake. Fruit cake. What's up, Aqua Fighter Wolf? Also, let me hit the fruit cake. Fruit cake. You gotta have it. Better na 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 na. Ugh, it's still gonna take forever, and I'm gonna have to fucking pop another elixir. Force. 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 The force. That's not how Ugh. the force works. Seven to eight. People voted seven to eight on this. Aubrey Monroe says no tail. Let the cheeks be free. That should be a poll. Cheeks. Cheeks, behemoth. Tail, let the cheeks be free. Can I say cheeks in the Twitch poll? I can. But you'd be surprised what words you're not allowed to say. You probably couldn't type rare nuts if you wanted to. That's probably true. We can test it. Nope. I'm gonna. Nope. Nope. Kahoot was great, I won. Oh yeah, that Kahoot was fucking elite. I think that was the best Kahoot. I loved it. Not yeah. even just because I won, but... We love Ram Jisam. Yeah. Ram Jisam. Oh my god, I've been saying it wrong the whole time. Ram Jisam would be much easier to say than Ram Gassam. But people let me say their name wrong for months and then, like, never correct me until I purposefully ask. Alright, we're getting somewhere here. My finisher does at least a little bit of damage that's tied to my magic. What's up, Andrew? Star Wars 7, the bastardization. <laughs> Doing some chippy damage here. Oh, oh no! 
Ugh. Oh no. But after this, I can drop out and I can uh, get my MP refilled. Hey, maybe I will play Proud and Critical Foods next week, Mr. Yeah. Shiverburn. It's definitely possible. Shiverburn has a monopoly on this next uh, this next week. Wow. And then Gavaka has a monopoly on the week after. Yeah, as long as I'm not dead. You better show up for the... Uh, well, yeah, you might be dead. I might be dead yeah, before the next Kahoot. You don't know. Yeah, sure. Um, but the... Uh, you gotta show up for the Psyx Kahoot for sure. Oh, yeah. When's that? Oh, yeah. Um, let's see. That'll be... That'll be... Well, that's a Saturday one, so... Mm. I could shuffle it around for you, though. Because then Godvaka has less of a monopoly. You know? No, we want Godvaka to have Well, monopoly. I want to make sure you get to play the quiz on your favorite character. But, 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 um, she, let the cheeks be free won the behemoth poll for the record. The cheeks shall be free! That's right. The cheeks shall be. The cheeks shall be? Cheeks shall be is a good uh, name for like a detective. <laughs> no, it's not. I'm just thinking of Scott Shelby from Heavy Rain. Oh, fuck. Last night I like kind of wrote a song as I was drifting off to sleep. And oh, yeah? I oh, that's, that's the worst. Yeah. I've had that happen with like just writing things or... Remember, we got money. We got money! That was a bad <laughs> night for you. <laughs> we got money! That was one of the worst nights of your life. <laughs> but, 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 we but, got money, though. But we got, listen, I'm always ready to record We Got Money. Who gives a shit about that other stuff? We yeah. We got money! <laughs> yeah. We got money! Oh. <laughs> Yo, Kiwi might have been born that day. There was we got money. Holy that shit. would make a lot of sense. Also, I should have dropped has, out. That has so much Kiwi energy. It's not even. It's not even right. It was the same year, right? Or was that the year before? Um. Was it the incident junior or senior year? The incident was uh, junior year. Okay, so yeah, it was the year before. But I got. I think that was like the kernel that popped into the Kiwi popcorn. Yeah. You know what? I should. A lot of that energy crossed over. For sure. I just got a text at like I don't know. It was pretty late, and you were like, "Patty, <laughs> what is it Patty, there's <laughs> Patty, beans. there's beans. We have a song called We Got Money." What about there's beans? Um, I Patty. love that. There's beans. Kiwi and I use instead of um instead of like tea or drama, Kiwi and I say beans. Like there's beans. I think because I said spill the beans. I think that's how it originated. Yeah. We Got Money doesn't exist, Carly. I wish it did. Other um, than that way of saying... We Got, we money. got money! That was like the chorus. We Got Money! That's, <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> There's like only a build-up to it. There's yeah. nothing more. We Got Money is a song that I... That a song I that never came to be. Yeah, and it's now... It would have been so good. We, you know, it, it only could have existed in that small branch of time, you know. And we, just, we got money. Yeah, because you know what you're thinking of, oh, Rachel. Yeah. The jukebox Dang. money. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah we got good. money. Yeah, it's Love Shack. The money. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's got big spread from the yeah. 52s. Happy Pride Month, everyone. <laughs> there you go. Love Shack. <laughs> Yo, you fucking Love Shack? Unironically slaps. Oh yeah, Love Shack's fantastic. Yeah. Who doesn't like Love Shack? I don't know. I have not met a single person who doesn't. Oh, I first heard oh, Love Shack when I was like seven. I was oh, like, yeah. <laughs> yep, there it is. That's yeah. where it comes from. The whole Shack shimmy! <laughs> Hey, uh, you're, you're telling me it doesn't come from when he literally says bring your jukebox money? <laughs> That's what I thought it was. Yeah, they say that too. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Oh! Don't die uh -huh. of the, the red armor. Um, I just recently took a Sporacle quiz about songs in the in the year 2007. 
2007 yeah. was fucking stacked. Like, if you look at, like, what charted that year, it's crazy to think that all of them were able to share the number one spot. Wow. I, I highly encourage anybody to uh, really go back and breathe in Let's see 2007. 2007 number one hits? Yeah. I mean, that was the year of, uh... Um... I can't think of any of them now. Well, low. Umbrella. Umbrella, low. I think that was the year of Toxic. I think that was the year of, um... By Beyonce. It was the year of fucking, um... Crank That, Soldier Boy, which I didn't like, but mm, yeah, that, was, that was a big song. Um, Ruthie, what's going on? Thank you for the 100. Um, Ooh, Stronger came out that year. Was that Stronger? Yeah, it was 2007. Um, oh, yeah, that's right. This is why I'm hot. Mm -hmm. What Goes Around Comes Around by Justin Timberlake. Yep. Don't Matter by Akon. Yep. Wow. Um, Beautiful oh. Girls by Sean Kingston, I believe. Girlfriend by Avril, Avril Lavigne. Lavigne. Huge. And how did all of those share number one? Stronger by Kanye West. It's crazy. Also, Merck's WW. Merck SWW. Thank you for the follow. And Ruthie said, um, oh, my brother and I thought he said, bring your juice box money. <laughs> yeah, I think <laughs> I probably thought that at some point, too. I get fucked up on the juicy juice. What was the number one song on your birthday? Oh. Look that up, Kiwi. I'm number on one song, October 22nd, 1996. Uh, mine was... Uh, Probably the fucking Macarena or something. It is. <laughs> nice. At least that's what I get on this, but I think this other thing was going to tell me it's Come On Over Baby, All I Want Is You by Christina Aguilera. Mine was No Diggity. That's way more fun than the Macarena. Yeah, the Macarena is what I'm consistently getting now. I can't believe it was the fucking Macarena for me. Uh, I'm so happy that I missed out on the Macarena. Yeah. But it was like it was like three weeks later is when you were born. Yep. Macarena couldn't hang on for a couple more weeks, so you could be miserable with me. <laughs> There's a Macarena reference in Final Fantasy X, did you know that? I um, in Final Fantasy X, there's um, a scene where Titus is talking to the other party members, and uh, Titus says, They said Seymour went to Macarena Temple, and someone goes, It's Macalania Temple, and Titus goes, I swear to God, it's so fucking dumb. I love it. I? I love that the. <laughs> <laughs> Discord didn't pick up like half of that. <laughs> I. I've got Fuck some whack ass blisters right now. Whack ass blisters? Oh, from all the walking. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do it. Oh, I should have a Roga up all the time. Is is your like a Roga like um, proximity damage tied to your MP style? I wonder. Probably. Like, I feel like I'm just fucking sh I'm just walking into him. Yeah, my Arogas do more damage than my Keyblade hits. Just from walking. <laughs> it's crazy. That's the power of the um, yeah, Cotton Eye Joe. Um, is it bad or is it good? Is it so bad it's good or is it unironically just good on its own? What do you think? Because I'm not uh, sure. I think it's so bad it's good. I think it's, yeah, I would probably lean towards so bad it's good. I think Macarena is just uh, bad. I would have liked to have been born in July, mid-July, because then it could have been California love. Ooh. Tupac. Yeah, that's way more fun than everything we've already referenced. Um, it was funny when I was working at my old job, and, like, everybody there was old as fuck, and they were talking about, like, how they remember, like, Biggie and Tupac. I was like, yeah, they died, like, you know, a couple months before I was born. Yeah, they died in, like, 96, or right? right? After. 96 or 5? I feel like Tupac died in 96. Yeah. Um, Macarena's bad, excuse me? I mean, I don't know. Like, all, like, the novelty dance songs, like, Macarena is my least favorite. Like, I'd rather listen to the Cha-Cha Slide. I'd rather listen to the YMCA. Um, does, Co months. does Cotton Eye Joe count as a... Uh, is that a dance song? Is there a dance attached to Cotton Eye Joe? I don't think so. Is there? 
There's this, there's a dance that people do to Cotton Eye Joe. Right, but there's not. It's not like in the, the original lyrics. Original intention, but yeah. There should we should do a bracket. Do, 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 do. Totally separate of Kingdom Hearts. I want to do a bracket of songs with dance instructions in the lyrics. Macarena doesn't have dance instructions. It doesn't. No. I guess it doesn't, huh? It doesn't tell you where to put your hands. It does hmm. not. Interesting. Maybe we should have like different quadrants, like songs that there are dances to, songs that have dance instructions in the lyrics, something like that. Mm -hmm. um, Teach me how to Dougie would be in that vein. But is that that's a dance? But th are there instructions in that? I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah. Hmm. Well. We'll think about this. We'll table it for now. See, yeah, YMCA, there's no instructions there either. Who teaches the YMCA dance? How did everybody... Is that in... Was there a music video that the village people had where they did it? I'm sure the village people were pretty... When did the YMCA song even come out? I'm going to say... Like the early 80s. I was going to say like 79, 80. Oh, yeah. Let me see. We've already derailed. YMCA. Not the thing, the song. Um, 78. Wow. Nice. Um, how would one even see a music video in 1978? Was MTV a thing? Yeah, right. It was not. MTV started in 81. Yeah. Huh. I don't know. There's a lot to think about today. So. Okay, well. <laughs> Presto! Where did he go to, little fucker? He's like way under my chair. My son fell. I would be in jail a million times if Prester was actually my human son. Mostly because they had him sitting on my microphone all day. Uh, um, Huggy Cool, thank you for the follow. Huggy Cool. Um, <laughs> don't call your son a fucker. Um, now where's my controller? I'm a mess. All right, let's uh, let's fight these bastards. Pots and bolts. Oh, I don't know why I use Thunder on the Thunder Heartless. It's fine. Ow. The bits and bites. The pots and bolts. Oh no, my foot's bleeding. What? Oh, from your my blisters? Foot's yep. God. You fucking walk the shit out of it today. Well, I didn't wear my usual walking shoes. Oh. Uh. And it's also been like three days, more like a week in a row of this, so. I have not died yet, no. Makeship, is that like a merch, um, place? Listen, I'm only in the 35th seed. I still have half the, the tournament left. I haven't died yet, Oh but... no! Oh no! It's Patty! It's Patty! He's, He's broken! broken. There have been no retries yet, so I'll be honest with you. I don't mind uh, admitting when I die. Um, I don't like this, though. Thunder? Yeah. Greatest moment of my life. What? I found band-aids, baby. Let's oh, go! Let's go! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> so excited. He's high on band-aids. Again. Yeah, baby. Guess who just fucking found band-aids? <laughs> that reminds me of uh, Streets 112. Are you familiar with Streets 112? I gotta send that to you. And I'm gonna send it to you on Discord. You don't have to watch it, but I need to make sure it gets to you. Because that's... Uh, uh, that's really important. An MR... What is it? An MRRL time. Look how fucking clutch I am! <laughs> it's very important. Um, okay. Fuck. Fuck. Kiwi does not live in a major enough area for him to dox himself. Hello, Liam. Wait, who said that? What someone happened? asked Someone asked where you live, what city you're in. I said, you're not in a major enough area, nor am I, to... Uh, if you, like, lived in New York City... He still shouldn't uh, say it, to be honest. Why? Who's trying to know? I don't know. Who? Holy 
fuck my feet. I was gonna walk to work tomorrow, but now I'm like... Oh yeah, it sounds like a bad idea. I think I need to drive. <laughs> I don't know. I'll be fine by tomorrow. Oh I'm just limping right now. Yeah. I can't I feel the bottom of my feet, but oh. I'll be alright. I'll be alright. Okay, Terra. Alright. That's the way. That's the way. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh -huh. I like it. Ow. Winnie the Pooh! That's my man right there. That's my guy! That's my guy! Oh, hell yeah! Winnie the fucking poo. Nachos! <laughs> Greatest moment of my life! I, I saw Nachos here earlier, and he uh, he was like here before the stream started, and then not after. Oh no! He was in the chat nachos. like half an hour before. Is it still thinking of fucking die? Oh, he is here. <laughs> Hi, Nachos. I'm getting really stupid. Yeah, it's okay. Hey man, it's alright. Dude, right. when I went to your new place and we fought, we did the cup, I could have sworn that like, using Thunder killed the Stealth Snake when he was invulnerable. Like, am I imagining yeah, that? Yeah. Do you remember? Like, what the fuck? Maybe it was just perfect, perfect timing or something. I guess. If this was a time trial, I'd be pissed. Be fucking pissed. Yeah. Magic yeah, Force. Yeah, that. Uh -huh. yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, Bella! Bella! Oh, hey, what's going on? Damn, I did not get that blue Rhapsody. Are you kidding me? Fuck! Oh, I should be using my Aroga. I keep forgetting. There's, like, not gonna be skin on the bottom of my feet tomorrow. Oh my god, dude. You took walking too serious. I went hard! You walked too close to the sun. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> I went ham! Why'd you turn into uh, the nanny named Fran? The nanny I went named ham! <laughs> Mr. Sheffield! <laughs> <laughs> oh, can we do I it? I a lot of the nanny. Oh, me too, on Nick and Knight. Yep. Um, I already did whatever key we wanted, Milano. Uh, I wish I could refund you those 2,000 points. I'll do it again. Kibbles and bits. Uh. Mm -hmm. We should do a uh, a bracket of like TV show theme songs. What do you think about that? Ooh, that just could be like, fun. Just like on a fucking Tuesday or Thursday. Just like instead of playing a video game. You and I definitely have different tastes on that. Oh, for sure. But that'll make it interesting. That'd make it more fun. Because then there'll, there'll be more polls, you know? I'd like to see what we actually would agree on. That would be the... That would be interesting. Well, people in chat, give me, like, two um, two theme songs, and we'll put them against each other and see if we can, like, do a little dry run of this. Um, a raw dog run? Yeah, a raw dog run of the, the TV theme song bracket. The I wish, I, I, wish I had you here for the fucking Christmas bracket. It would have turned out different. Oh, my God. I would have fucking... Yeah. Ooh. War is over. Would have won. Okay, the Fairly Odd Parents theme song versus the Danny Phantom theme song. Uh, um, Fairly Odd Parents. Yeah, I think I have to go with Fairly Odd Parents actually. Guys, how does the oh, Yo Danny Phantom? He was just fourteen. That's how that one starts. Yeah, I know. But the wordplay, not the wordplay, but like the rhyme, the rhyming of all of those things that Timmy wishes for, that kind of puts it over the top for me. Yep. Um, you guys are naming a bunch of things that I don't know. Full House versus Friends. I think you have to go with friends. Yeah, you do. That clap is iconic. Um, Arthur versus Dragon Tales. Arthur. Right? Do you were you a Dragon Tales uh, kid? I actually think I like Dragon Tales. Really? More. Dragon Tales, Dragon Tales. It's almost time for drag. It's a little repetitive. I don't know yeah. if I I don't know if I like when the the song says what it is over and over. Sorry, Although I guess Fairly Odd Parents does that though, but not as much. Victorious versus Fresh Prince. Well, Fresh Prince. Victorious yeah, is Fresh just Prince a Victoria Justice song. Yeah, I think Fresh Prince is probably the favorite. Even in a post <gasps> even in a post slap society, I think. Uh. Post slap society. Sweet life for Hannah Montana. Um, 
why can't I? Th I can only think of the Sweet Life on Deck for some reason. I can't think of the original. But I guess I can't weigh in on this one. I think I'd have to go Hannah Montana. You know Come on, uh, Drake and Josh versus iCarly. Um, Drake and Josh. Drake but... and Josh. Yeah, even in a post Drake Campania society, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> American also in a post slap society. Yeah, I guess like we're not not living in both, right? Uh, I don't. Okay, Castle Oathkeeper. I've heard of Amphibia. I don't think I've ever heard of. Oh no, I've heard of both, but I don't know what either of them are about. Owl House or Amphibia? I don't know what those are, to be honest. Um, the Ar I Carly theme does bang, but the Drake and Josh theme bangs harder. Pokemon versus Digimon, Digital Monsters, Digimon are the champions. I'm sorry. Like, I, like I'm not saying the Digimon one is bad, but the Pokemon one is is too iconic. Family Guy versus yeah, the American Pokemon Dad. Pokemon one is the shit. I think you gotta give it to Family Guy over American Dad. Oh hell yeah! I'm not. I'm trying to not even like take the, like you know. I'm trying to just go by the context of the song. All yeah, that versus the. Did the, the Amanda Show have a theme song? I think it's all that by default. Man, 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 man. Oh. Amanda. Oh, you know who? Uh, uh, fucking Stuart Copeland from The Police. Oh, he also did the Spyro music. He did the Amanda Show theme song. Rock and Roll Hall of Famer Stuart Copeland? Is yep. that you? Mm -hmm. Hey Arnold versus Chalk Zone? Ooh. Well, Hey Arnold is mostly an instrumental with Helga just saying Arnold, so I'd probably give it the Chalk Zone. Arnold! Rudy's got the Chalk. Oh, yeah. Hey. Fucking. Yo, Rudy's got the Chalk, dude. It shreds in the middle there. Were you a Chalk Zone kid or no? Uh, no. Fucking love Chalk Zone, dude. That was like a show where like I just wanted Chalk Zone to be real. Maya Milano. Total you Drama know, versus SpongeBob. I do like a lot. Hmm. I like the Magic School Bus. Oh yeah, that's fun. Little Richard. Is that who did the Magic School Bus? She did. I had no idea. Yeah. Amphibia is about frogs that impale children. Crazy, I haven't heard of this. Kim Possible or Chalk Zone? Call me, beat me if you want to reach me is really strong. Ooh. See, I wasn't even a Kim Possible kid, but the song is really good. Yeah, mm. the Kim Possible one is pretty good. I'd, I'd probably have to give it to Kim Possible. Um, Gargoyles, I don't remember enough. That was a little out of my realm. Um, recess. Okay, instrumental face off recess versus Hey Arnold. See, I can't think of how the recess one goes. I... But I am kind of biased. Like I, I was more of a Nicktoons kid than a than a Disney Channel kid. Sailor Moon versus Hamtaro, as if I know what either of those sound like. Ooh, DuckTales would fucking go so far. I did, like DuckTales was before my time, but DuckTales would sweep. Original Scooby Doo versus SpongeBob. Oh man. What do you SpongeBob think? SpongeBob theme song is pretty. It's really good. Unstoppable, yeah, it is. B fifty two is covering like simple and clean. Uh, how do I do that? So bring your joke box money. Simple and clean is the way that you're making me feel tonight. There you go. <laughs> you gotta, <laughs> you gotta have like a strong upwards inflection on the last part. What does that mean? I, I have, have to meet to your father. <laughs> it's hard to let. Let go! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Presto's like, I've had enough. I'm checking out. People are I dropping off it. slowly but surely as we just talk about theme songs. It sounded like Ursula? Fuck! Fuck them. Yeah, fuck them. The real ones are sticking around. All you're right. right, you're right. It's true. It's true. It's true. These fucking regular pad casuals. Right? Yeah, I think we definitely know now that the bracket needs to happen, right? And I think it needs no. to be a... No? It's <laughs> the most shocked to know of my life. I upset you. Oh. Well, you did. He succeeded. Well, you succeeded. Has anyone said He-Man? Really I don't think so. <laughs> he did. Fucking crushed my sensibilities just now. What? Um, I can't think about the He-Man song goes. You really gotta, like, hit the 90s and 2000s for me to really, uh, you know, early 2010s. Because I don't watch a ton of, uh, TV anymore. Really, any. Um, who would rig, rig Paco up against in his inevitable epic rap battle of history? Probably Keynode. <laughs> Kafaka. 
regular Pat versus Kino. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. I thought you were gonna say Kiwi. At I mean first, no, you're gonna you're gonna be like the guy that comes in on my second verse to help me out. Yep. Um, yeah. Oh hey boys, let me take it from here. <laughs> yeah, it's me, Kiwi. Hey fellas. Would you rap with the the cadence of Frederick Douglass? No, I wanna rap with my actual voice. I don't think I've ever You've never gotten wrote to wrote a verse that was actually with my my real voice before. No, because you wrote a verse in the Trump voice for our school yeah. project. It's true. I wrote a verse as Kim Jong-un, but with my voice. <laughs> so, that's how we chose to do that. <laughs> Regular Pat versus Osama Bin Laden. <laughs> it's just Osama. Oh, Sama! Burn! Lotta! Forget! God. <laughs> that's, uh, that's dangerous. It's a scary reality. Yo, as told by Ginger, someone once told me- Yo! Nachos! I gotta hit him with the nachos. Kenobo Ooh, versus Kino. Yeah, as told by Ginger. That's the one by Macy Gray, I think. I do not know who that is. But it's well, a lovely song. I think she's the person that did the I oh. was told by Ginger theme song. <laughs> Is she best known for that? <laughs> no, she did a song called like I'll Try oh. Two in like the mid two thousands um, yeah, opening theme. Her. Yep. Opening theme I'm in between by Macy Gray. There you go. Known for her international hit single I Try from nineteen ninety nine. Astral by Ginger's got a nice theme song. I'm sorry, I didn't get to thank Nachos properly for the five gift subs, 383 total. That's going to be Indifferent Towards Shift, Ultimu Shadow, The Arc King, The Closing Door, and Mr. Smitty Werbin. Which is probably short for Mr. Mr. Smitty Werbin Men Jenkson. Something like that from Spongebob. Eliminate um, Stand Man. Eliminate Destin Man. <laughs> um, I'm sorry that I... Mr. S S Smitty Werbin Jaegerman Jensen. There we go. I got it. Um, as Told by Ginger versus All Grown Up. I think off the top of my head, it's As Told by Ginger. Cyber Chase? Oh. I think I still have to give it to Arthur, though. Ooh. I did it. Congrats. Thanks, Carly. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Fruit Fruit cake. Cake. Fruit cake. I'll do it again. <laughs> thank you. Fruit cake. Thank you. Jack saying thank you would be great, actually, as a drop. Thank you. Oh, no. Ooh, Pepper Ann versus Doug. Those are very evenly matched. Do 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 Cyber Chase versus Jimmy Neutron. I think I gave it to Jimmy Neutron. Are you familiar at all with Cyber Chase, Kiwi? No. No? There was uh, no. two kids and their bird, voiced by Gilbert Gottfried, did math in space to solve crimes. Oh, yeah, okay. You know I what? Know I feel like I feel like it's very similar to the fake Robin Sparkles show and How I Met Your Mother. Yes, right. <laughs> it sounds very similar after I described it. Two beavers are better than one. Right, of course. Two beavers are better than one. I have seen. I have not seen like a full episode of Goof Troop, but I know the song. Fucking Goof Troop, they always stick together. That one, Zaboomafoo. Mm. Does that have a theme song? I'm a big Zaboomafoo guy. I, I love Zaboomafoo. Song, but I love. Zaboomafoo. Yeah. I also the love Zaboomafoo. Brothers. Yeah. Oh my god. The Darkwing Duck I did not watch. Step on me. You know what? I'm gonna use an elixir. <laughs> Thunder. 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 Hey, did you know that I was Tim Pool? I did, unfortunately. Um, Tim Pool... I was gonna say, like, among the uh, other right-wing commentators, but he says he's not right-wing, even though he totally is. Yeah. I'm not right wing, but here's all but my I right wing. But I guess I'd rather listen to him than Ben Shapiro or like Dave Rubin. 
Fuck you, Dave Rubin. The yeah, Dave ultimate grifter. He's a big grifter. No, no, no. Uh, Candace Owens is, is the, yeah. Candace is the biggest grifter, yeah. And then Dave Rubin. God, it's like a fucking gotta catch them all of people I hate. Yeah, they all suck. Oh wow, yeah. my Aroga does not last a long time at all. Um, is that even worth using? Come on. I think it is. It's 2 MP for a continued stream of damage. Ow. Come on, Serb. Um, I'm, not, I'm not looking at the chat ooh. right now, but the, what did the chat think of the political conversation? They, they just waited for it to be over. Oh, you meant this one? Or that yeah, one? Yeah, yeah. No, um, no, that one. I think if they had anything to say about it, they would have said it on Thursday. They would have roasted us? I mean, nobody in the VOD roasted me, but people don't often comment on the VODs. So. Yeah. Uh, Carly lived for we it. Were done, I was like, oh, well, did we talk about this too much? What's going on? What, yeah. What's going on, mate? What's all just in? That's right, you do comment on the VODs sometimes, Castle Oathkeeper. I didn't mean to paint the issue with a broad brush. <laughs> um. No, I think I think it was fine. And again, if anybody had any problems with it, I, I preemptively told them to go fuck themselves. So <laughs> I have that, that that safety net now. I can I can tell people to fuck off. Hey, do you mind fucking off? Maybe if it was February 2021, Pat, I would have uh, been a little probably not actually. Oh, better heal. I don't want to use all of my elixirs on this. Come on, fucking off. Take a wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Um, I recommend everybody type tickle, wiggle, wiggle into their YouTube search bar. That could be dangerous. Um, make sure your safe search is on. <laughs> I guess. Come on, fucking off. Oh, I remember Ubi, but did it have a theme song? Ubi was the one that was hands. The hands. Yeah. I didn't actually like I it at all. God, you know what I hated? Um, Angela Anaconda. That was fucking terrifying. My name is Angela. Hey, hello. That shit. Hi, name's Patty. Hi. Yeah, my theme song would go hi. It's me, Patty, and the show would start. <sighs> hi there. It's me, Patty. It's your boy, Patty. Hey, what's going on? It's your boy, Pat. Fucking Cerberus, man. He's taking forever to die. Yep. Keeps throwing up black vomit. Patty, every time that I'm on the phone, or on this, this Discord call with yeah. you, I get mad fucking home runs, man. On, oh uh, my God. on MLB? I'm playing a game right Yeah. I got it right this time. Yeah. You did it, Patty. You Proud did it. of you. Two for three. <laughs> That's right. You only done fucked up once. Hooray! That voice. He only done fucked up once. I, no, don't. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> you know, it's easy to forget. <laughs> Come on, Serb. I think I've done very good. You've done a great job. Dropping anything. You've done a great job. Probably better than you thought that I'd do. Uh, yes, everyone's always better than I, th I think they'll be. In my mind, everyone's going to be terrible. Sorry, folks. It's a very boring fight because I have no strength. My MP doesn't regenerate fast enough. It's, it's an interesting verb. Um, great to ruin Powerpuff Girls. I can't think of the theme song, to be honest. I never watched Powerpuff Girls. Um, can you please uh, never sing the Angela Anaconda song again? Of course, yeah. I would love nothing more than to never do that. How much more do you think you have with this playthrough? Um, that's a loaded question. <laughs> I have to do all the cups still. Not all of them. I have to do this. I have to do time trial for Herc, time trial for Hades. Um, maybe time trial for Pegasus? I don't remember. No, I got that one. Um... I gotta do all the jungle sliders, I gotta do all the gummy missions, I gotta fight Unknown, I gotta fight Sephiroth, gotta fight Kurzisa again. Um, I gotta synthesize Ultimate Weapon, so. 
A lot. Ow. But you know, we're getting there. Sounds like you want it to be over though, Ruthie. Is that what you're telling me? Because I'll tack on another five fucking episodes. No, I'm just kidding. I did not beat Ansem, no. at least take that many. Oh yeah, for sure. If I play three hours a stream... Yeah, for sure. Especially since I'm fucking weak. Nickelodeon versus Cartoon Network in terms of uh, just run a poll on that? Okay. Better... Which one's better, I'll say. That's the Nick, 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 Nick. Yeah, Nick. I'm, I would vote for Nick. Am I Nick, allowed to Nick, vote? Nick, 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 Nick. Mm -mm. Cartoon Network didn't have a little jingle. Or if it did, I don't know. Hi, I'm Paul. Hi, I'm Paul. What uh, the fuck? What? What is that? Hi, I'm Paul? Yeah, like, no, I know what oh. it is, but like... Who conceived of that? I have no idea. That was like the little... What the fuck? Their little bumper. What the fuck? What the fuck? Yo, Damien YG. Damien NYG, thank you for the follow. What the fuck? Um, I hardly watched any uh, Cartoon Network. I really only ever watched it by accident. I don't know why. It's not like I wasn't allowed to. I just like... I don't know, I liked the Nick shows and... I didn't feel the need to expand beyond that. I never broadened my horizons. Damn it. Damn it. God damn it. Oh, damn it! God damn it! Oh. Come on, sir. Go down. Oh, that was almost a death, baby. Ow, fuck! Oh no! Oh no! Alright. We got it. Now we're halfway through. Maybe a little bit more than halfway? What seed was that? Um, Evening Detura, thank you for the follow. Cartoon Network had some gross shows. Name a gross Cartoon Network show. I am interested in that answer as well. Yeah. Also, Nick is beating Cartoon Network right now, 13 to 10. Good. What's up, Hokage Good. Jeff? Um, Hades Cup Solo is what's popping right now. But first... Hey, hey, hey! Um, I need... Oh, I'm out of elixirs. I know the rules. Do you know the rules? Do you know the rules? Clarence? What is Clarence? That's a show? Clarence from... Clarence Oddbody from, uh... Uh... It's a Wonderful Life. I... Oh, the he's the, the angel, yeah. Nothing to it. Who's the most famous real Clarence? Uh... Maybe, like, the saxophonist from the E Street Band, like oh. Clarence Clemens from... Oh, that sounds familiar, yeah. Which of the cups is my favorite? I mean, the Hades Cup has so much going on in it, you know? Um, I actually like a different cup more than the Hades Cup. The Hercules Cup? Yes. Yeah. I just think Hercules is so lame at the end as a, as a finisher. You Hercules know? is mad lame. Hercules Not that Rock is Titan isn't also mad lame. Um... Nickelodeon beat Cartoon Network in the poll. Good. Although a lot of people didn't vote, so democracy That's failed. That's the way. That's the way. Would you rather be overly aggressive toward employees anywhere for the tiniest inconvenience or believe in astrology, live your life by it, blame your wrong... I'd rather do all that. Um, I'd rather just... I know, I know you said blame my wrongdoings on astrology and force others... I mean, what, is, what does it mean to force others to do the same? Am I holding Kiwi at gunpoint and saying you better believe in astrology? At that point, I take the gun off of you with my bare fucking Shoot me in the face with it. And roundhouse <laughs> kick you. <laughs> You're not even going to use the gun. No. I don't need it. I mean, I would much rather be a weird astrology guy than be really rude to employees. It's a power move to have a gun, but choose to kick choose somebody to kick, in the face yeah. instead. I have a gun, but I'm going to kick you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, wizard holding me at gunpoint to make me believe in astrology. Wizard! Wizards! Thunder. Thunder. That's wizard, Annie! What is that? 
in, uh, in, in The Phantom Menace, one of little Anakin Skywalker's oh. friends says that. Okay. I forgot and that they call Anakin in, Annie. Yeah, it's gross. And then in The Mandalorian, The Mandalorian says, It's wizard. It's, it's wizard. It's a callback to The Phantom Men oh. Menace, but it's way more badass when he says it's so. Gotcha. Um, I have not seen Little Shop of Horrors, but I do know that's where, like, um, the big plant's from. And he says, feed me Seymour. That's about all I know about it. Feed me! Feed me, Seymour! Lil Orphan Annie. At least they shred the shadows. Did you know that Anakin Skywalker was immaculately conceived, Patty? I did not. That's crazy. Yep. He's just straight up Jesus, huh? Yeah, pretty much. And they call him, like, the Chosen One. Remember when Jesus cut off his son's hand? Oh, yeah. That was cool. Yeah, I remember that. My favorite part of the Bible 3. The Bible There's episode 4. There's only one four. hand, Patty. <laughs> what? There's only one hand, Patty. What do you mean? Luke has two hands, and then he gets the one cut off, right? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I thought you said his hands off. Oh, no. I might have accidentally, but I know it's only one hand. Watch it, champ! <laughs> you better be careful, bucko! I'm about to get really fucking anal in here. <laughs> oh, God. Wait! Oh, fuck. Oh, wait, I should have my Arogon. I'm gonna burn all my MP again. I feel like the MP recovery rate for these enemies is fucking abysmal. Fucking die! What the fuck? You know what my favorite thing in the treasure video is? No. You wanna know? Sure, yeah. There's a thing where, like, <laughs> you get to, like, Hollow Bastion or something, and you're like, you'd think that I'd say something dirtier, but honestly, I'm getting a little <laughs> tired. Oh, uh, that... like that. <laughs> that's, uh. <laughs> I think it's I think it's Hundred Acre Wood where I jump into the stump hole. Uh, <laughs> I think. Oh uh, yeah. You think I'd say something dirty, but I'm gonna <laughs> I'm a little burnt out. <laughs> yeah. It was in That's earnest too. To <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed that. The treasure guide I had to like put moments in there so I didn't drive myself nuts because it was so boring to record. That's an old video. Here I am. One of the oldest. It's like video four or five, I think. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Die, Oppy Arm. I'm not gonna die to you again. Oppy. There you go. Don't drive yourself rare nuts. Yeah. I'm almost done with my simply spiked lemonade, which I probably should have finished an hour ago. You got the rare nuts, right? Of course. Okay. Yeah. Just like in life, or oh, yeah. the last time I played KH1, probably. No, this. Run. Oh, this run? Yeah, I believe I've done that. I think I must react to my old videos at some point. Maybe we'll make like a uh, some sort of uh, subscriber donation goal out of that, because I'm not eager to do that. <laughs> I mean, listen, That's the old videos—they're like 2019 videos. That's not even that long ago. And they're not cringe. Yeah, there's. I mean. I think the level one guide is kind of cringe, just because I don't like how I sound in it. But, um, um but this is pretty good, Gavaka. I'm not. I'm have a couple more sips left. But. Not as cringe as like other people's old videos, though. Mm -hmm. But you could react to other people's cringe old videos, though. Yeah, that'll get me in no trouble whatsoever. <laughs> no, fuck no. Yeah. Um, I mean, when you start making content. Like, I started when I was 22, so... Um, yeah. You know, not that I've not done things that are cringy since then, but most of them aren't oh, on YouTube. Oh. Speaking of uh, doing things that are cringe, yeah, you gotta cut it out with saying the whole girlfriend word. Oh, I can't say girlfriend in its entirety? It's mad cringe. Saying bro. girlfriend is less cringy, or is more cringy than saying girlf? Yes. I right, see you're the first person I've heard to uh, propose that to me. Yeah, you gotta stop. Okay, I'll say girl. 
I just feel like it's harder for my tongue to get around that word. Girlf. Like, I feel like there's an obstacle. Girlf. I don't know. The R into LF combo is tough. But I'll, I'll do my best. I'm always yeah, working to be better. better. Apparently, better. Kiwi says girlf. I do. I feel like I'm going to get called cringe for saying girlf. Yeah, and you can tell him to fuck off because mm. Kiwi said it's okay. And who's going to argue with that? I feel like multiple people in the chat right now. What? I, I, I said I feel like multiple people in the chat right now are going to argue that. Yeah. Except for Castle Oath well, they're, they're just robots over the internet right now, so what are they going to do? I guess. You act. You actually know me, Jam. And I'm That's telling true. you. I do that know That if you, you ever use girlfriend in my presence, I might have to kick you. Um. Alright, you're going to kick me with my own gun? I have a uh, strawberry lemonade now. We're moving on to that. And then after that, I have a watermelon and a blueberry. But these two were the ones I most wanted to try. I like how that threat was met with, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh-oh. Okay, he's dead. Can I go now? Can I go now? <laughs> Love that. Yeah, I don't know. There's just, like, certain words and, like, the way people say them that don't uh, hit right. And, and girlfriend is and one yeah, of them. Yeah, when, when people do the whole thing, when they're not just like, yeah, the GF or mm. the significant other or, like, the the other half or something. Oh, like, I hate, you know what I hate? I hate hubby. Oh, yeah. I hate hubby. Kind of Wifey, tragic. too. I hate both of them. Um, well, how do you feel about boyfriend? Boyf. Boyf? I mean, boyf is way more fun to say than girlf. Boyf is great. Yeah. Um, what's up, Cloaked Ninja? Yeah, boyf is really fun. Girlf, I just feel like it's, it's hard for me to, to get there. But I will never be a wifey or a hubby guy. No. No chubby hubby? I mean, listen, if it's the ice cream. What, what is chubby hubby, actually, ice cream-wise? I feel like it's a peanut butter thing. Boyf of these nuts! <laughs> what? Hello. What? What? <laughs> the horror. What? <laughs> Slightly in his hubby, cubby. <laughs> they are dating? Ugh. Okay. I gotta fight Leon and Cloud. This might be where my first death comes. Here comes death. It's death time for Patty. Death day for Patty. What are we thinking for that? What is wrong, what is wrong with you? With you? <laughs> oh. Completely earnest. What is wrong with you? It was so earnest. Hey, what is wrong with you? <laughs> I meant it. Oh, fuck. There it is. That's one, folks. And I got to start all the way over from that seed. You died? I died. Oh. Leon got me. So if anyone said below one try, sorry. I failed you, but I doubt anybody did. Nachos wants to go back in time before hearing the word girl. <laughs> he hates it. Ew. Nachos. Sorry, Nachos. Cubby appears in the Chip and Dale movie without the iconic- Oh no, Pan! That's what you get for saying boyf. Come on, Ruthie, boyf is fun. Nothing to it. Don't be such a curmudgeon. Okay, listen. It doesn't need to be girl. It needs to be something not, that's not girl. Can I say GF? Yes. Okay. I mean, there's only so many options. Seeds? There are 50 I, seeds in the I'm cup. I'm literally only against one thing here. Everything else is fair game. Okay. Go for it. I didn't, it fun. seemed like you were more pro-girlf than anti-girlfriend, but really you're just mostly anti-girlfriend. Yeah, that's the correct arrangement there. Oh, I also don't like honey. Honey! I like saying yeah, honey to people that I'm not romantically interested in. I like that. But in earnest, I don't think so. Patty! Patty! Baby! I do unironically like a babe, though. I'm sorry. That, uh... Babe? <laughs> babe! Babe! It's a hundred floors of frights. Yeah, honey's acceptable if it's followed by WHERE IS MY SUPER SUIT?! I agree. <laughs> Um, Pam Jackson! Girlf is so bad that if I started saying it to be funny, I wouldn't be able to stop. I can't go down that road. 
Who's that? Uh, that's Sea Keg the Punslinger. Aye, aye, aye. Ask me questions about my psyche, bad Runemancer. No, yeah, unironically, I enjoy the babe of it all. Bit. <laughs> Beb. B E B. <laughs> hey, Beb. Beb. On your floors of frights, Beb. Hey, Beb. Hey, it's on your floors of frights, Beb. Ah. Bear. 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 <laughs> um, Just keep saying it. My favorite movie about a live action talking pig? Well, it's either Babe or Charlotte's Web, right? I'm actually not seen either in full. Are you more Babe or Charlotte's Web, Kiwi? Babe! Babe! I feel like Babe is the more respected one. Am I right there or am I wrong there? You are right there. Yeah, Babe so. is a Best Picture nominee. Yeah, okay. Charlotte's Web is like a little kid movie. Yes. Yeah, I thought so. I like Babe. 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 What's your favorite regular Pat VOD? I like the one where he says Babe over and over. <laughs> Alright, Patty, what word are you not going to say from here on out? What word am I not going to say? Yes. Girlfriend, apparently. Yes. Really, only around you. I'm gonna say it around everybody else. Yeah, that's fine. That's okay. Fine. I mean, if it if it means sparing your feelings, then uh, I'll avoid it around you. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Of course, dude. So your girlfriend likes that you would refer to her as your girl. Uh, when I talk about her, yeah. like not in her presence, I'll like use something that's not girlfriend. But if you if you were for some reason you had to say hey here's so and so I've said she's girl, yes <laughs> okay oh well if I'm introducing her I'll be like yeah this is my other half GF, right something like that got it. I could I could see you pulling off oh this is my GF I can see yes. that I have um, an aunt who's a nun and I think I pulled the GF on her yeah it's, I had no idea I had an aunt who's a nun <laughs> yep. Wow, I'm still I'm yeah, learning I'm more and more about man. you. Yeah. Um, Nacha says he'll pay me to say girlfriend exclusively around Kiwi. Um, Kiwi, do you mind if I get this bag real quick or no? I do mind. Uh oh. Nacha, is it, you gotta name your price, and then I'll see if it's worth uh, Kiwi's respect or not. Oh my god, Oppy Arm. Whatever his price is, I'll up it for you to delete the Nacho's greatest moment of my life. <laughs> from. Oh no, Nacho's earned that. You get a sound drop if you're in top three. Yeah. Does Gru call her his girlf? <laughs> I understand that reference. Okay, girlf. You know what my girlfriend did say re I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my girl. <laughs> and just hasn't yeah. paid me yet. That one wasn't too bad. Okay. That one wasn't too bad. She said that, uh, that, uh, Steve Carell now is, uh, more attractive than, uh, Chris Evans. What do you think about that? No. Yeah, that's what I thought. And she showed me a bad picture of Chris Evans. I was like, that's not fair to Chris Evans. Look up another picture. Because she gave me, like, the worst picture of Chris Evans next to the best picture of Steve Carell. Um, and Nasha, thank you for the thousand bits. It's what I got right now, and what the fuck? <laughs> I don't know what you're referring to, but I appreciate the, uh, the, uh, the candor. Vaka says she's gonna fight my girl. Boom, 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 boom. That's what I'm saying. I, I think Chris Evans is a beautiful man. He is a beautiful man. I mean, I mean, I, and not to say that Steve Carell does not look great right now. He does. If you look yep. up current Steve Carell, he's a, he's a silver fox. He's a he's a bit of a zaddy. He's hot. Yeah. Oh no, he's hot. Oh my god. <laughs> um. No, I, he's hot. 
I feel like I really ignited something here. Yeah, that's. I think that's what she's saying. That Steve Quirrell has the whole Dilf thing going on. Um. So. But like Chris Evans, that's uh. You know, that's that's the top shelf. Oh no, he's a Dilf. So. Ow. Bummer. Do you think Ryan Reynolds is conventionally attractive? I mean, obviously conventionally, but like, I feel like, uh, I think he is, but I've met people who were like, no, Ryan Reynolds is overrated. And I think they're just kidding themselves. I think they're upset. I guess I'm asking yeah, are. both you and the chat, but, like, come on. Yep. Look at Ryan Reynolds and tell me that's not, you know, an attractive man. Yeah, he's one of the hottest celebrities. <laughs> that's, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Bow, bow. Happy Pride, everybody. There we go. Uh, Ryan Rentals is is attractive. <laughs> Ryan Rentals is that is that our our dish name for Ryan Reynolds? <laughs> He's like a rental car. Ryan Rentals. Ugh. Um. That's what I was saying, Rachel, is that I, I, I don't know if I if I read it somewhere, if I heard it somewhere, but someone was like, I think I talked about, have I talked about this on stream before? Someone was like, uh, women don't think Ryan Reynolds is as attractive as men do, which is amusing, but it's, it's, is, it's hardly possible. Yeah. Like, is that, maybe Ryan Reynolds is like what men want to look like, um, but not exactly what, what women conventionally want. I mean, obviously, we're painting everything with a broad brush here. Everyone has their type, but speaking generally... Um... A lot of the appeal of Ryan Reynolds has become Deadpool, and I feel like yeah. that's like mainly something that, that boys disproportionately <laughs> like to girls. Okay, two things really quick. I want to say to Funky Falk, congratulations on Xehanort being the winner of your KH Hunger Games, because for me, he uh, cried himself to sleep, I believe, and broke his ankle. Um... I can't get over Ryan Rentals. Ryan Lentils Rentals the third. Second, um, I don't know. Was Ryan Reynolds not as big of like a like? Oh, that's the hot guy before or after Deadpool. Like I, I guess he it, had like the hot guy thing. Yeah, that's for sure. But was he like the hot like guy? Like. like remember when the hot guy was like Brad Pitt? Oh uh, yeah, he still is. Brad Pitt's extremely. But hot. he's but he's not the hot guy. Like let's say there's there can only he's be not one the hot guy. Right, but he's extremely hot. Sure, though. sure. Uh, Brad Pitt totally was the hot guy for a sec there. Probably a couple of sec. <laughs> Probably for a couple of years. Um, but, like, Megan Fox was that for women for a while. Like, around the first Transformers movie. Like, as I was in, like, middle school, and, like, if you're going to, like, name a hot woman, you would name Megan Fox. Um, right. So. You should trace the lineage of these titles for people. It's Chris Evans, the hot guy, right? Like, I don't know. I, I feel like Timothy Chalamet was the hot guy for a sec there. I don't think he is anymore. But, like, a year ago or so, I think that's who it was. It was Timothy Chalamet. He's very good. Right. I thought he was younger than me. I, I, I Wikipedia'd him recently. I think he's actually older than me. Wait, let me, let me verify it's a True this. fact. Wikipedia that. Yeah. Um, Stephen the Hack. Uh, Timothy Chalamet. He spells his name with two E's. Oh yeah, he's he's a year older than me. I always thought he was like fucking nineteen. Um. <clears throat> anyway, is Paul Rudd the? I mean, who is the hot guy and the hot girl right now? You know, Paul Rudd I, is very hot. Is it Paul Rudd right now though? He is the sexiest man alive. That's true. Jack Harlow. Ew! What? <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> I'm no! just reading. I'm just reading chat. Jack Harlow. No! He's an American rapper from Louis Louisville, Kentucky. He's an ugly fuck. <laughs> he, he's giving me, like, Post Malone right now. I'm repulsed by that. He's fucking Little Dicky. Oh, that too. Yeah, he's like Post Malone Little Dicky. Yes. He's also... Oh, he's not in the NBA. He's just wearing an NBA shirt in this picture. Okay, I was confused. Well, Kiwi hates Jack Harlow, so. Um, Idris Elba. Ooh, hot. Yeah. Yeah, he's a daddy. Sure. Um, 
Tom Holland is too boyish to be the hot guy right now. Yeah, it's true. See, like, I feel like Zendaya is the settler. Zendaya. I always get it wrong. Zendaya is the settler. Tom Holland is the reacher. Um, yeah, Zendaya is yeah, Gorge. We should Zendaya take, is great. We dude. should pick She's other other celebrity couples and determine who's the settler and who's the reacher. I'm trying to... I can't think of any celebrity couples right now. Usually the girl is the settler, though. I feel like the hot guy is kind of like who both moms and daughters... Yes, is that, is, that is perfect, yeah. And Tom and, Holland, I don't think any moms are thirsting over Tom Holland. I mean, I think I think it works... Oh, well, obviously Ariana is the settler and Pete Davidson, but... Listen, Pete Davidson's probably... He's probably a good boy, you know? I think people are too hard on Pete Davidson. Um... I think uh, no one settles for Tom. Listen, if one person's settling, I promise you Zendaya is settling for Tom Holland. I'm sorry. Tom Holland is the reacher. Um, yeah, Tom Holland's more of the cute boy, even though he's probably older than me. Um, Zendaya is Michi, by the way. I don't know if you knew that. I'm saying boy. It's fun. Um... Just wait until you start saying girl. Beyonce, have a really good time. Beyonce settles for anybody. I'm not even a Including big Beyonce Jay -Z. guy, but especially she settles for Jay Z. Yes. Jesus Christ himself could descend, and Beyonce would be settling for him if they got together. Um. <laughs> listen, oh, I'm son again. Of God, I yeah. guess that's okay. <laughs> yeah, I guess. And, and she'll sing songs about him. Um, Tom Holland as Nathan Drake is one of the worst casting choices of all. I haven't even seen the movie. I just know Andrew yeah, Garfield bad. is the best looking Spider Man. I think that's a pretty cold but true take. Yeah, I agree. Wait, cold? It's a uh, yeah, it's a cold take because I think everybody agrees with that. Like, who who's gonna tell you it's Tobey Maguire or Tom Holland? I mean, mm. people might say Tom Holland, but okay. And yeah, maybe yeah, yeah. in and maybe in the early you know the mid two thousands, people might have said Tobey Maguire, but you know that's not what we're talking about now. I mean, yeah, I mean, Toby Andrew at his Garfield. peak versus Andrew Garfield at his peak. I'm sorry, Toby. Andrew Garfield's very attractive, and yeah. he's so charming. Yeah, he's a very charming guy. The charm goes a long way. You still think it's Tom, not just? I have a comment. Yeah, sure. I feel like Pete Davidson's probably not a good boy. You don't think so? No, I feel like he's probably kind of a douchebag. I don't think he's a douchebag. I don't know. It's hard to tell when you're just looking at the public persona, but... Um... I think he's probably troubled, right? He's got a lot going on. Oh, yeah, definitely. Oh, but, no, I mean, I sympathize with Pete and yeah. everything, but I'm just gonna guess that, like... Probably I not probably a great boy. I not want to hang out with him. Uh, but I will say that Pete is settling for Kim Kardashian. Yeah. Which reminds me, you also hate the Kardashians, right? Yeah. Okay, gotcha. I mean, I hate most people whose whole thing is that they're rich. You know? They're famous because they're famous. Right. I mean... You know. There's only only so high a celebrity can go in my rankings. But, like, most celebrities' whole thing isn't that they're rich. You know? Right. It's usually that they're in movies or that they're good at something. And they became rich because of that, right. yes. Not because they were the best at what they did. They were in the right place at the right time, obviously. But Hey, like we were talking about. Yeah, remember that thread that we were closing? Oh, yeah, I remember um, that. Oh, yeah, I mean, I think it's well documented that Pete has a huge dong. Mm, yeah, that too. So. Ba-ba-ba-da! Fire! See ya! Ba-ba-ba-ba. Ariana also said that, so it's it's all, you know, multiple sources have, uh, have validated this. I have no MP. Um, see, I don't, I don't follow the royals, to be honest. I don't know enough about Harry and Meghan. Wasn't Meghan, like, a actress in a TV show? And then there's a whole hubbub about Harry marrying her because she wasn't, she was an American actress. Here's a quick comment about 
uh, Ariana Grande yeah. and relation to dong size. Sure. Really quickly. I'm really scared of what's like, about to happen. Uh, well, it's not too bold, but <laughs> I just feel like most dongs probably look big when you're like she the size is of Ariana petite. Grande. Yeah, that's true. Like she has like baby hands and like. Fuck me! Oh, I wasn't paying attention. <sighs> You're distracted by dong time. Yeah, I was just thinking about dong. <laughs> I was thinking about Pride Pete's night. dong. I can't believe Pete Davidson's dong got me killed. Um, I think that was just a stand-up bit, Nachos. I think that's play being played for laughs. I can't believe this fucking bullshit. Damn it. Anyway. More about tong, I guess. Tell me more dong stuff. No, I mean, that's it. I just think, like, it's a well-known thing. That, like, no, yeah. The smaller the hands, the bigger the dong looks. I mean, I think that's just a general relativity sort of thing. That's, like, what Einstein yeah, wrote right. about. There's nothing... Yeah, that's exactly what Einstein's example Einstein was, talked about dong all the time. Yeah. Hi, Ruthie. Um, yeah, so I'm at two deaths now, so if you uh, guessed one or two deaths, you lost. Um... Bow, 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 Real quick, bow. remember when it was actually in the political discourse about Donald Trump's dick size? Yeah, that was le that a legitimate happened. part of the political discourse, yeah. Yep. That's a shame. Hate that. Ew, he's Ew, cheesy. he's gross. His hands smell like me. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. Hot dog! <laughs> Mickey Mouse. Remember that song they sang in the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse? Hot dong, hot dong, hot diggity dong. Yep. Ba, ba, ba. The what now? I can only imagine what the chat was like when I was talking about dong there. They loved it. They I promise that. you, they loved it. They loved the dong talk way more than the political talk. And then we just mixed the two, so... Now they're confused. What am I doing? I'm trying to get through the Hades Cup by myself, but I keep dying to Cloud and Leon. That last time, I was just fucking not even looking at it. Like an idiot. Like a fucking idiot. I need to go super serious mode when I get back to them. Yeah, no, there was like a whole thing about uh, the Russians had a P-tape of Donald Trump. Oh yeah, the P-tape. That still so. exists. Definitely. Yeah, it's still somewhere out there. That's That might be the closest thing to a conspiracy theory that I believe in. Me too. Me too. Because I was other than like the existence of like a after like consciousness. Sure, type sure. Of thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I remember. I don't know if I was. It was with you or somebody else. But I was discussing like. I, I feel like um, the modern conspiracy theories all have like a conservative slant to them. But like, yeah. what is like the uh, like what's a conspiracy theory that like most liberals could get behind? And uh, mm -hmm. you know, I guess if the P tape is a conspiracy theory. Yeah, but I feel like the, I feel like conspiracy theories used to be like bipartisan. I feel like like nine eleven inside job was like a bipartisan thing. I feel like uh, the moon landing was a bipartisan thing. Right. So I don't know. Skeptics from JFK. Both ends of the spectrum, kind of. I guess JFK is a thing that I'm pretty close to believing in. Oh yeah. Hmm. Although I've not done like the big deep dive on JFK, so. No. Nah, but I, I wouldn't be shocked, you know. That's something where I wouldn't be shocked. Thunder! I, uh, I, like, almost immediately eliminate people from my potential friend pool if they're 9 11. Oh, yeah, same, for sure. That's, like, one of the closest, probably, like, one of the top five things that, like, you could subscribe to that it's, like, oh, yeah, I can't do this. Actually. Yeah, no, I can't handle that. Like, yeah, even I agree. people that I'd otherwise like, like, I'd probably tune them out pretty quickly, like... Yeah, for sure. That, that's that's hard to come back from. Yeah, hard, hard pill to swallow there. Yeah. Um... The Epstein thing is a left-leaning conspiracy. Um... I feel like even people on the right think that he did not actually kill himself. I could be wrong, I don't know. I feel like I hear that so often that I can't even I feel like everybody like says that. Who started it. 
I think it just seems kind of obvious that it's true, but... Like, if that's a conspiracy theory, then I, I guess I believe in that one. The thing about the P-tape to me is that it's just, like, so on brand. Oh, yeah, it, it makes a ton of sense. Like, it's too real. Well, because, like, if it's a left conspiracy theory, then, like, it's it's on brand. Like, the right conspiracy theories are that, like, Hillary Clinton, like, eats babies in the basement or something. You know, like, it's it goes right. too far to be believable. Sure. Like, there's a ton of uh, believable things you can make up about Hillary Clinton that I feel like they don't do. Um, <clears throat> right, I guess, I guess there's disagreement on who killed Jeffrey Epstein. A lot of, uh, wow, we really just get into it. So. Boom, 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 boom. Wow, look at that. One Sundaga baby. Did you pass, uh, Cloud and Leon again mm -mm, yet? Nope. I was watching a video today, and the person was talking shit on Metal Chocobo, and I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. Well, what uh, were they saying about it? Just that it's trash. I was like, now listen here. I, I don't, don't really have any utility for it, but, like, it's not a bad keyboard. I use it a ton in the original KH1. I don't really use it in the final mix. It's not, like, D tier or anything. I do not want to talk about the Depp Herd trial at all. I have, like, no yeah. interest in discussing that. I mean, what a f oh, god! I'm not gonna I'm not gonna talk about like the actual people in it. I more so want to say like, what is wrong with like we're gonna look back at that and be like, why did we like pay so much attention to this thing that should not have? I mean, I I just don't get it. Like the not sequestered jury thing is weird to me. Like how influenced by uh by the media it all was. Like I don't know. Maybe I just don't fully understand how that trial specifically worked, but. Um, I don't think something like that should be made a show of, you know? I'm not saying, like, we shouldn't get to know what happens, but I feel like the way it was covered was just, like, ridiculous. Like, I was actively not looking for stuff about it, and it just found its way to me. Like, I was inundated with Depp Herd trial shit. And I was just, like, after the third day of it, I was like, okay, enough. And it went on for, like, another two months. Um, that's so, the power of the yeah, that's the thing. Like the sportification of uh, of a defamation trial about spousal abuse is like really disturbing to me. Um, regardless of like who did what, I just I just don't like it at all. The other day, I said that Chaos Ripper was my favorite Keyblade, and I can't remember if you said what yours is. Uh, KH1 Ultimate Weapon. Oh, nice. Gavaka, nice, nice. where are your badges? Do you see? Look at the chat. Do you see Gavaka with no badges right now in Fruitune? Do you see that or no? Me? Yeah. Computer's in the other room. Oh, you're not even looking at the stream right now. I told you I'm not looking at the what stream. What the fuck? What happens? Carly's badge is gone. Nachos. Nachos. It's the worst moment of our life. Okay, now we're back. Okay. That was so weird. There was like a period where nobody had any badges. I saw it both on OBS and on Twitch. Huh. No, they're all back now. Okay, that was really weird. Okay. Twitch, uh, turned the power off for a sec. Alright, I had to focus on this Leon versus- and Leon and Cloud fight. You have to? Or I have to. I, I really need okay. to. Because <laughs> I've biffed it twice now. Oh. What? My heal jumps aren't working. Alright. A home run! Ooh! Get this! The best you can do? I should do grounded combos on these guys. Oh, oh, oh. Uh oh. Um, okay. Uh, you know what? I'll use an ether. Yeah! Stop it! Stop. Stop it. I don't want to lose again. You've got this, Patty. Thanks, Kiwi. I believe in you. Do my grounded combos. 
Fucking juggle him with a Roga. Yeah! Another home run! Oh my god, dude, you're crushing it. Oh! Something about being on the phone and disassociating from the conversation, like, just... No, it crushes your home run ability, yeah. It's really good shit. Unstoppable. I'm unstoppable! That's my Dark Riku impression. Is that any good, or...? Yeah, it was... It's fine. Really, really good, actually. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> it was really, really good. Oh my god, that was... That was, that was Dark Riku! Dude. Oh my god! Oh my Wait, god! You? Yeah! The spirit of David oh. Gallagher. Wow! Alright, Cloud, alright. I got Leon. Patty, chill. <laughs> What the hell is even what that? The hell is even that? <laughs> Come on, Claude. Angry Claude. Mitt. Ugh, Angry Mitt Romney. Bro, relax. Hello. Hello. He's a, a sexy, sexy guy, and I think all the gamer girls are really gonna like it. Yeah, I know I, I like it. <laughs> I used that drop in uh, in my video coming out tomorrow. Oh, by the way, video coming out tomorrow. Um, what is it? It's called Investigating an Old KH1 Myth. Oh. Yeah. Donald doesn't heal. That's not it. <laughs> I've already thoroughly dismantled that one. It's one of my most KH1 popular videos of all time. Camera. We've already dismantled that one too. On God, new video? It's true. Probably 5 or 6 Eastern tomorrow it'll come out. Patrons uh, at the 10 and $20 tier can already watch it, actually. Let me just Ooh. plug the Patreon. Or if you're QE, I'll send it to you. Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, yeah! It's shorter. It's like 9 minutes. Um, it's kind of nice. stupid. It might not hit for everybody, but uh, I yeah, am. I might listen it. to that on my watch. From yeah. Work. You don't need to see it. You just listen. Are you being honest? Um, I am. Okay, good. I mean, a lot of the times I fucking agonize over picking out the right footage to have um, over my narration, when in reality I know that people are gonna just uh, tab out and, you know, look at Twitter while they listen, or, or go on a walk. So. Uh huh. Yeah, my most popular you video know, is, in fact. You from work. Yeah. Most popular video is uh, Did Sephiroth Adjust. What? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh God, Cloud and Leon! Welcome to hell. Welcome to hell. That's three. That's three, and I used uh, I used elixirs on that one. I used an ether actually. It's fine. Fuck. I'm confident that uh, Cloud and Leon is the toughest uh, seed in this tournament. I think it is. I mean, maybe like those Angel Star invisible combos um, towards the mm -hmm. end, but. Like this is brutal. I, think I Cloud had him. I had one. Leon done, and then fucking Cloud gets me with a stupid swipe. Oh my god! Disney sequels is not my most popular video, but I think it's like top five. Um, I don't know the best way to check that. To be honest, I'm sure there's like a button I could click on my analytics page, but. Ooh. Ooh. Um, yeah. I think up there is Sephiroth, the Donald healing meme one. Disney cheap quills, KH1 and 2 boss rankings. Like, those are the ones that are, like, over 200,000. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, Treasure Hello. Guide. Is tre I think Treasure Guide is under 2, but above 1. I'm going to do a sequel to the Disney sequel video at some point. Um, oh, yeah. I'm going to watch Jungle Book 2 and Peter Pan 2. Probably all the fucking Tinkerbell and Winnie the Pooh movies. Yep. Um, did I do Sea Keg's impression from earlier? Sea Keg hasn't redeemed it, not within the last hour. I don't see a Sea Keg impression in my queue. It was like five years ago? Uh, it said, Pat, do Sea Keg's impression. Sea Keg never redeemed an impression. But I, I'm willing Are to do it. Are they trolling you, Pat? No, no, I see. A yeah, Andrew, this was literally like two hours ago. Literally two hours ago. 
By the way, um, I had another home run. Oh my god. I have to review my own sequel to the sequel video? That's fair. 102 Dalmatians? Is that the Glenn Close one? I guess I had to watch that, right? Am I watching live action? Daddy, chill. Oh, wait, here we go. We have the rankings here. Number one is Did Sephiroth Just? Two is... Wow. Disney sequels is number two? That's great, because I put a lot of work into that one. It was still not scripted. I'm glad that there are... Okay, at least three out of five of my top videos are scripted. And four out of five are ones that I worked hard on. Ghost Away 39. Thank you for the follow. I might have butchered that. Ghost of Wii? The Ghost of Wii? Um, I'm surprised the Donald Healing meme one is in the top five. Um, thanks, Fierce Zelda. What's the difference between a well-dressed man on a bicycle and a poorly-dressed man on a unicycle? Oh, I've heard this. Uh, attire. <laughs> attire, A-T-T-I-R-E. It's a great joke. Bom. Ghost of Wee Wee. Sorry for ruining it, Allie. Sometimes I get it. You missed a lot, Cloak Ninja. It depends on how long ago you got that ice cream. Which, by the way, when the stream is over, I'm gonna eat some fucking chocolate chip cookie dough ice cream. Yeah, Patty. What's your, uh, is that your top, uh, top five ice creams, would you say? I feel like we've talked about this before. What one did you say? Chocolate chip cookie dough. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I think it's probably... It's top, top three. three. Yeah, same. Yep. My top right, three, bro. it's like... It might be my number one, but also up there is cookies and cream and mint chocolate chip. Um, I'm glad to have you, Ghost of Wee. Ghost Owl. I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying out a couple of different things. We can't believe it's my fucking fourth time doing this set of cup seeds. Is it an all Hades Shack Cup Shack stream? Shack. And the whole Shack Shimmers! Come on. At least I'm getting levels, that's good. Yeah, cookies and cream is great. I feel like there's less variance for a good cookies and cream than a good chocolate chip cookie dough. Like, I feel like you might get like a chocolate chip cookie dough that's not that good. Um, but, Ghost O. Ghost O. W E thirty nine. Are you familiar with those freeze pops that are just like ice, but with like the food coloring and a little bit of flavor? Yes, they're like a little tube. plastic tube. Yeah, I mean that's like the shit growing up. It still is. Yo, I bought a pack of those yesterday. Oh my god. Flavor ice says Carly. Yeah. Greatest moment of my life. They're so good. They are amazing. The only thing is like the grape ones go uneaten. For me, at least. I don't want the grape ones. Flavored ice just kicks my dick off, dude. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm not drunk, but I'm uh, I'm tipsy. Um, tipsy? Also, oh. Deltarune stream highlights is my least popular, but yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. I'm I'm sure Spyro highlights are like right right there with it. And probably like the uh, two years of regular Pat one is is also down there. Also, the wraps are all down there too. The raps are all low, which is bullshit because the raps are better than like several hour long scripted videos sometimes. I am drinking. Right now I'm drinking a Simply Strawberry Lemonade Spiked. It's good. I think I like it more than the, the lemon flavored one. I'm going to keep doing the raps until uh, I don't feel like doing them anymore. I don't care how many of these they get. I have like, I still have another two in the works. I like mixed drinks, you know? I like sweet things. That's, that's my whole brand. <laughs> Patty likes mixed drinks. Patty likes mixed drinks. I wish I, I could find... I was trying to show my girl the picture of when we went to um, the nice bar on the square with Rob. And he took a picture of me and I just... He said... The caption is, Pat's fucked. And I do look fucked. I couldn't find it though. Rob! I am like less than a mile from Rob's current location. Oh really? Yeah, me I didn't and even... Rob were like we live very close to each other. I didn't even know he was still in the area. Yeah. Well. Oh. Um Ow. Um Rob's straight A's, man, he's a fucking beast. Do you know what that's from? 
No. That's from the video of when he was trying to breathe fire, but I started recording it after he breathed the fire, and the video was uh, me yeah. waiting for him to do it. Yep. <laughs> Which was the drunkest I've ever been in my life, was that night. Bonfire oh, yeah. night! Oh yeah, we had you taking all kinds of shots that night. I honestly stopped after that. I can't. I was like, I can't do this anymore. For most most people, they have that kind of night and they shake it off and they do it again next weekend. That was like, that was a no go for me. I was like, I never want to feel this bad ever again. Yeah, Kiwi was like in his top ten that night. That was a top ten for you too. Yeah, cause right. I'm glad it wasn't just me. Remember how much like mixing of different yeah, styles of drink there was. That was the problem. I, at one point at that party, I was taking shots, chasing it with beer, chasing it with wine. Oh my god. Like, it was <laughs> yeah, that's, disgusting. That's ill-advised. It yeah. was like classic don't do this behavior. Oh. Thank you, Waka Fighter Wolf. Spyro, well, it was, you know, it was, it was stream highlight, so I'm glad it helped. And then the raps are all, listen, thank you. Um, yeah, no, that was easily top one for me. Um, number two was probably the Survivor Party. Survivor I don't know. Party. It's, Survivor Party was top five, for sure. Um, there's probably a couple other times in college that were high up. The time that we had to go to the TV studio the day after, <laughs> like, that was really bad. <laughs> what about Patty slides down a hill? Patty slides down the hill. I don't think I was like fucked that night, but I was definitely I was definitely drunk. What if that was the same time? They could have been the same time. That's that's true. Because it was the winter, was it not? Yes. Was I it wish not? I wish I knew where that hill was. I know where the hill is. Do you? Oh yeah. I feel like it was like near a Turkey Hill or something. It was very close to Turkey Hill. Yeah. It was actually very close to two Turkey Hills. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Because you're in very close proximity there. Yeah, it's behind one turkey hill and, like, in view of another turkey hill. <laughs> the non-PA people are like, what the fuck is a turkey hill? <laughs> um, Sad. Oh, I'm CK, you're right. I need to try the sea salt ice cream cocktail. I gotta go out and get the stuff for it someday. Oh no! I'll make a point of it. Because I don't want to, I do. Daddy, come over, I'll make it for you. I gotta get the ingredients first. And Sea Cake sent me a Sea Cake, where'd you send me that list? Is that on Discord? Shit. This fucking opposite armor is such a time sink. Encom. Encom? Encom. Like the Tron company? Yep. I thought so. You know it? You love it. It's Encom. Women. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I was expecting. I, uh, I was actually binging over simplified videos yesterday. Oh, yeah. I watched that Prohibition video. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> that is a stream meme. Yeah, it is. You know him. You love him. Women. Women. Yo, Turkey Hill ice cream. So good. He is. He's pretty good. Um, oh, it's in my Gmail. Okay. I'll be able to find it easier. Simplified, one of my favorites. One of my favorites. Um, Nikki Glazer, one of my favorites. <laughs> Nikki Glazer. Um, yeah, Turkey Hill ice cream is the exact kind of ice cream I'm, I'm gonna eat after the stream. It's gonna be Turkey Hill cookies, uh, or, uh, chocolate chip cookie dough. Cookies. Um, but yeah, Turkey Hill also has great iced tea. Um, I, see, I feel like people in, like, the, like, northeast, like, east coast, like, they have Turkey Hill products, but they don't have, like, the Turkey Hill locations. Right. Um, what do you think of... What do I think of reading terminal, Andrew? Is that that thing you sent me? I haven't gotten to read it yet. Um, when I go to grocery stores, I have to say, <laughs> this looks like a good place to find some ingredients. I should. Tell this me more, Andrew. Looks like a good spot to find some ingredients. Um, ben and Jerry's is probably better, but you're going to, I mean, they don't sell Turkey Hill ice cream in like the little pints. Am I using the right m unit? Ben and Jerry's typically come in pints, right? Would that be the right word? Yeah. yeah. Like the that small ones, right. the small ones that are like, like yay big, like my hands around. Yay big. Like yeah. Um, 
Yeah, Turkey Hill is like a 7-Eleven, basically. That's like... Because we don't have 7-Eleven. Do we have 7-Elevens up here? I've never seen one in, like, our immediate area. Not very close, no. Yeah. We don't have too many 7-Elevens near us. There's a Wawa closer to us. Oh, yeah. 7-Eleven. Yeah, there's a, there's a Wawa closer than I thought. Um... Ooh, I like Wawa. I like Sheets better. Same, but I like Wawa. Yeah, no, Wawa's fine. Um, they're building a, a Sheets even closer to the one that's already near me, which is exciting. That is exciting. Good for I was, you, Batty. I was about to you. say, like, the street area, but that's not a good idea. <laughs> nope. Nope. Alright, so, so here is the, uh... Here is the uh, sea salt ice cream cocktail recipe that CK is sending me. Two ounces of light rum. I like plantation, but Bacardi works well here. 0 0.5 ounces of blue cur curacao. Is that how you say that? Curacao? Cur curacao? <laughs> I don't know. Um, one ounce fresh lime juice. One ounce cream of coconut. Can be homemade, but simply squeezed makes a good store bought one. Um, half ounce of um, or. Orgiat? Or or Orgiat? Orgy eats? I don't know what that is Ooh. either. Three Orgy. to four three to four drops of saline solution, shake and strain over ice. That's like a lot of work. Curacao? Curacao. There you go. Oh yeah. That's no. why you come over so I can make it for you, buddy. Right, okay. You're gonna make it for me? But then I have to they yeah. want me to drink it on stream though. Oh. Yeah. Well my internet's pretty good, so <laughs> True. True. Um, how do you say that word, ZK? Or orgiat, <laughs> orgiat. Pat talks Orgy. about orgies. It's that stream, that time of stream again. Thunder. Oh, Pat, he just can't stop talking about orgies. I can't. It's a sickness. I can't stop talking about orgies. All right. I just love them. Figure it out. Why? I'm asking for help. I'm al I'm always looking for the helpers. That's what Mr. Rogers said. All right, we're back. Fucking back at it again at Krispy Kreme. Back at it again. Come on. Oh, very close to dying already. God, my feet are so raw. <laughs> Gross. The other day, I asked somebody, like, how many pills do you take in the morning? And they were like, none, I'm just raw dog. <laughs> I saw a tweet about that recently. That's funny. Someone was like, uh, the tweet was like, how is anybody not on medication? Like, how are you raw dogging in the end of the world right now? Yep. <laughs> Which, yeah, I, I, could, uh, I could see that. That's tough. They then clarify that they are on pills, but not the ones that we were talking about. Right, right. So they're not actually raw dogging. Yeah. Very few people things. are raw dogging it in the end of the world. Can't imagine that. I mean, I take a pill for my GERD. Does that count as not raw dogging it for the end of the world? Yeah. Um, That's not for like my mental stability. That's for my coughing. Also, Barnabas, yeah. thank you for gifting your 11th gift sub to Cap... Capitian Blitz. I thought it was Captain Blitz, but it's definitely Capitian. Capitian Blitz. Thank you, Barnabas. Krispy Kremes are neither crispy nor creamy. Is Krispy Kremes national or is that regional? Because we have them for sure, but I don't know if that's like a national thing. I think it is, right? Krispy Kreme? Uh, Krispy Kreme. Interesting. Uh... Andrew says national. Yeah. Oh, wait. Fuck. Ah, ah, oh god. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Jesus Christ. Fuck you, Leon. God. You know what? I'm better off literally running into him than hitting him. With my Aroga. Because my hitting him just pushes him away and he doesn't get hit by the Aroga. Oh no. Oh no, Patty's dumb. That's not true, fella. Oh, thanks. You're stupid. <laughs> um, You're stupid. Um, Aubrey M Monroe does not have uh, Krispy Kremes. Closest one is in PA. Uh, it's in Tejas. It's national. I guess national, but not like truly everywhere. It's not Starbucks national. It ain't Mickey D's national. Does anyone else? Michael D's. 
Do you guys call McDonald's anything that's not McDonald's? Because, like, we'll call it McDicks or Mickey D's. McDicks is just me. No, I've heard McDicks from other people. Oh, okay, good. Um, McDee's, Mickey D's. They call it Maccas in uh, Australia, I think. Michael D's. <laughs> it's a Maccas. Maccas, one of my favorites. One of my favorites. I can't believe I lost a solo cloud. Fuck. Power! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. Oh. Heavens. Good heavens. Betsy. Heavens to fucking Betsy, dude. Oh, shit. You're winning, son? Uh, not really. Hey, you need a break? I could use one, yeah. What a sweetheart for asking. Leon, we love him. We love him. He's a charming boy. Yeah. Listen, I'm not anti-Leon. Alright, he's done. You've talked a little shit in your day, though. I've talked a little bit of shit, but my stance is an anti-Leon. I've talked a little shit I'm about things I love. Pro Leon. No, yeah, that's, that's true. Alright. Uh oh. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Oh fuck. Fucked up that third one. Fucked up the fourth one. And he just straight up whiffed on the fifth one. Cool. All right, it's not happening again, baby. It's not happening again. Ow. I think something got into my garbage last night. Like a creature? Yeah. That's upsetting. I walked out and there were like fucking peanut shells on the front porch. I was like, oh no. Dude, you fucking joking me, mate? You, you, you fucking joking me? Did, uh, did you get bears up where you live? Oh, like, yeah. Like, not where you are now, because we get bears all the fucking time. Yo, SKB, a whole ass year, or a whole ass year. Would you rather a whole ass year or a whole ass year, Kiwi? A whole ass year. Yeah, same. Um, but thank you, SKB, for the 12 months. That's crazy. A whole year for SKB? Jesus. He just got here. And SKB with the five gifts. Also, SKB's getting married, everybody. I meant to Yay! talk about that in uh, an Ultima Club. I think I was half asleep when I saw the announcement. But SKB, everyone say congrats to SKB. Fucking tying the knot. Getting married. Congrats, and the, SKB. The five gift subs for 82 total for Potato Colada, I Love Vampires 20, Ashley Spyro, Cloaked Ninja 16, and Drummy Bear 82 from SKB. Thank you so much, dude. And again, congratulations, dude. That's a big move. Jeff Probst would say, that's a big move. We love that. We love that. And um, KH Lelov is continuing their gift sub they got from Carly. Look at that. Look at that. Thank you so Yay! much. So much, so much good stuff happening right now. Dude, Whew. amazing vibes right amazing now. Amazing vibes. Love is in the air. Um, <clears throat> Whew. love Whew. is in the air, and folks, we love that. We love that. And love is in the air, and who can say no to love? Right? We love that. <laughs> Nachos oh, gifted a sub to Castle Oathkeeper. I was like, you know what? To be honest, I didn't say it in the moment, but I was thinking Castle Oathkeeper should totally have a sub badge right now. Um, so thank you, Nachos, for remedying that. 384 total for Nachos. Nachos! Um, right, S SKB? We were just talking about the word girlfriend and how uh, some, oh God. some might say girlf instead. Now, would you abbreviate fiance? Would you say just your fiance? It's kind of fun, actually. Your fee? Isn't it if... Oh, I beat Cloud, by the way. Um, if Good it's... Job, uh, isn't it spelled different depending on if it's the man or the woman? Fiance. That's true. Fiance with two I E's. Learned, I learned that while writing obituaries. Oh, yeah? Yep. Man, we did, like, really death-related things in our our past occupations. Yeah, yeah. You, you wrote obituaries, and I would literally input someone as deceased in the, the government's database, in the SSA database. Yep. That's weird. You didn't think you'd be doing that when you got your degree. Just 
fucking well, talking about i guess you know for your for yours it made more sense if you're working on a newspaper and writing obituaries mine was not really in the uh what i had in mind <clears throat> somebody said it before we graduated i wouldn't have been like what i would have been like but what I'm like oh that's a little that's not exactly what i had in mind if but... someone said to me that you'd be like uh you know listing people as deceased i'd be like what <laughs> only for a couple of months thankfully um that does not count as a cup loss um so we're on three losses right now i have to pee that's why i've paused i have to pee so do you want to talk to the chat or do you want me to run an ad oh wait 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 don't yeah. go pee yet don't okay. Go pee. okay 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 hold on hold on are you gonna come back and talk to chat yeah, right. I need to look at the chat, though. Right, that'll help you. Oh my god, there's so much going on right now. Regular piss? Yeah. Um, you're not wrong. I'm not in love with the phrase regular piss, but you're not wrong. <laughs> Barnabas thought I was about to <laughs> recount my past as a hitman. No, not quite that exciting. And I would literally make people dead. I mean, as far as the government was concerned, I, I was. <clears throat> I mean, you know, SSA was not the only branch of government. You know, I only was responsible for inputting people as deceased if they were receiving money from the government through, like, you know, social security benefits. Um, are you back yet? Can I pee? Hold on. I'm about to piss myself. Best oh song that came God. out in 2007. I think probably Toxic by Britney Spears, if that was 2007. Toxic by Britney Spears is the best song of that decade, potentially our lifetime. It's really good. The drunker I am, though, the more likely I am to think that it's the best song. Um, let me find it. Right, oh wait, that I was am. that was two thousand and three, two thousand and four. Never mind. I apologize. In the VOD, if you're commenting about Toxic, you should have watched this far. I'm, I'm correcting the correcting the record. Um, so Toxic is not the best song of 2007, only because it didn't come out that year. All right, Patty. I will... Uh, take over? I will let you take... Yeah. But my shotgun answer is probably Umbrella by Rihanna. Uh, all right, I'll be right back. I was going to put up Pat, my can screen. Can you hear me? The chat can hear you for sure. Let me know you can hear me. All right, chat. We're gonna have the, uh, we're gonna do that Q&A like we did yesterday. Give me the uh, AMA, AMA, Q, uh, chat. Here we go. Thor, Vanita, Thora. Roxas, Serventus, Roxas. I'm eating frozen ice right now. Zemnus or Anthem? Billy Zane Anthem. If you went to the Olympics, what sport would you play? Mmm. Basketball. Three on three basketball. Goofy or goofy? Goofy. Favorite KH1 world? Uh, Hollow Bastion. Opinion on actual Kiwis? I fucking love Kiwis. How much pain are you in on a scale of one to ten? Really good question. Uh, I'd say it's two. Uh, what's your movie of the year for each of the past five years? Oh, come on now. That takes too long. What's happening? But I like the question. If I had more time, I'd answer that. Maybe Patty will give me the platform to What's happening? That. What's the question? Uh, simple simple and cleaner sanctuaries. Simple, simple and, clean. and clean. Yeah. Aqua or Luxine, Aqua. Uh, the ice flavored with cherry. Aqua or anti-Aqua, Aqua. Are you mad goofing? Always. Uh, best game you've played in the last year? Jesus. You're not a big new game guy. Oh, boy. Ooh, I just realized I've been forgetting to get my clock tower gifts. If I had a Roomba, what would you name it? <laughs> hmm. I have a Roomba. Oh, yeah. 
Um, Skellington over Sparrow. I'm not ending yet. I never said I was. Oh, for me, for showing up. You could, you can still ask Kiwi questions. I'm not here to stop that. I'm here to hear it now. All right, I'm, I'm gonna answer that question that that Sea Keg the Pun Slinger asked me, mm -hmm. which is, what's my movie of the year for the past five years? Oh, okay. Yeah, go ahead. I'm not including 2022. Sure. That doesn't it's count. Not over yet. I mean, okay, fine. My, uh, I, I I haven't seen many movies in 2022, but number one is uh, uh, hold on. Everything, everywhere, all at once. Oh, people love that one. I hear about it all the time. Yeah. Um. Uh, that's number. That's 2022. Let me look at my letterbox um, and see. I gotta <laughs> you, look at my fucking list here. Yeah. Um, I have not seen any movies that came out this year yet. Um, does Inside count as a movie? Because that'd, that'd be my pick for 2021. <laughs> it can count if you wanted to. I want that to count, but if it doesn't, then I would probably make it in Kanto. Hmm. And now, then... if Inside counts, that's probably mine as well. Okay. For 2021. Yeah. All right. Let's see here. Let's see. Let's see. I'm 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 gonna go hard. I have bad Rune Mancer. I have and Kiwi has not. All right. 2021. Uh, possibly gonna get ripped for this, but uh, don't look up. I've heard good things about that. Yeah, it's, it. it's a little divisive. It's it's kind of up my alley. Okay. Uh, 2020 is The Sound of Metal. God, Bach, I've never seen Great Gatsby. 2019 is Joker, and then Parasite is very close behind that. Mm. Sorry for being trash and liking Joker <clears throat> and advanced no, people. Okay. 2018 is Black Klansman, and 2017 is Get Out. Get Out's really good. That's my. Um, uh, that's 2017 to 2021. Well, I'll, I'll do mine. I have much more limited options. Um, so we'll say Inside for 2021. If not that, then Encanto. Uh, Soul for 2020 because I didn't see a bunch of movies from that year. Um, 2019, I guess, has to be. I guess it's The Lighthouse, actually. Nice. Yeah. And then it would be Endgame behind that. Um. 2018. Um, I liked Bohemian Rhapsody. That's fine. Um, 2017. Not Phantom Thread. <laughs> not the Emoji Movie. I guess it's Get Out. If I had not seen Get Out within the past month, I would have said uh, Coco. Nice. I've seen Judas and the Black Messiah. I think it's uh, fourth from that year for me. I think uh, Sound of Metal is number one, and then The Father, and then uh, and then Stoll, and then uh, Judas and the Black Messiah. Judas and the Black Messiah was like radical and interesting. Uh, I felt like. Uh, it didn't like give me as intense of a response in the moment as I thought it was going to. Uh, uh, it, it didn't like. It wasn't as shocking and provocative to me as I'm sure it was to like a lot of other audience members, and so like some of the impact was kind of lost. Like I feel like if you're already mostly like cool with the Black Panthers, like in your head canon, then you probably will. Uh, will mostly get on just fine with Judas and the Black Messiah and like I feel like a lot of people are not and so that's why it's you know more powerful to, to people who are not in that that world and not about that vein there um, I have no comments on that because I don't know what any of that is but um, this is the fourth try that's right Kavaka you don't know what the Black Panthers are oh I know Black Panther Oh, you mean like the actual no, Black Panthers? The Black yeah, no, I, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, not I don't the superhero. Know what that is, but like, 
I meant like the movie. No. I'm talking about the historic. No, yeah, I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. Partly about. The You're cutting out for me, but I got you. The movie is partly about the Black Panther. Right, gotcha. I feel like the movie was made to like target people who don't like Black Panthers and like to give them a different point of view on them. Right. And they were like doing interesting community stuff on the side too. I mean, it's not all about that, but like that's partly what it's about. And I think it's going to strike those people as more interesting mm. than it is people who are mostly right down there. with them. Right. Already. Okay, I get that. Yes. I was also preoccupied by Fat Bandits. It happens, dog. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway, just to say that, like, a lot of its more provocative elements, like, I was mostly in agreement with, and so it was more, like, interesting than it was, like, the shock value that some of it was going for. Right. I'm getting yelled at for uh, shimmying. People didn't like my shimmy. I was having fun, though. That's all that matters. So you could actually fucking eat it. <laughs> um, what else? T t let's talk about other things. <laughs> or we can not. Uh, we can sit in silence as I bully this angel star. What did I do? You didn't do anything. I don't know. I was just trying. Uh, somebody asked me about Judas and the Black Messiah. I was trying to explain like what it did. For no, me. yeah, I, <laughs> I I appreciate the explanation. I don't think anybody in chat is mad at you about it. I'm not no, mad at I'm you. I'm just talking about you. Oh man. no, I well, I don't. I was yelling at God Baca for being rude to me for no reason. She does that all the time. Um, let's see. Ooh, I almost fucking evaporated all of them. Bye, Sea Keg. Thanks for the fun question. Yeah, bye, Sea Keg. Thanks for stopping in and encouraging my drinking. Ba -na 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 -na. Let's make politics stream two the politicking. <laughs> the Dream Sword's not a Keyblade. Everybody yelled at me for that, for the fucking Smash Bros video. You fucking moron. Idiot. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Fuck off. God fuck it. You hate me? No, she loves you. Come here. I'm sorry, guys. I guess it's like an all Hades Cup stream. I, I don't know. It's got to happen at some point, you know? These are. This is the reality of the 100% run. Is that I've got to do all of it. Of course, Sea Keg. We're all doing our own conversations now, yeah. Oop! You almost caught me! Patty, give me a talking point. Talking point, um. Um. Uh. Uh. I forgot to respond to your text earlier today, but we were talking about the trolley problem. Oh, God. And how Republicans are obsessed with the trolley problem. Holy shit. <laughs> and you're exactly right. It's like, well, they have to like, they have to like put it in this little fictional scenario in order to think critically about it. God, I have such a delay. <sighs> oh, almost he got said... shield checked. Thunder. Thunder. What did I say? You said. Why are right-wing internet freaks obsessed with the trolley problem? They are. And I said because the trolley problem is impractical, so it's perfect for people whose entire identity is based on detachment and building straw men. Yes. Everything can be solved with a hypothetical anecdote. I apologize for not responding in the moment. I was working on my video, but... Yeah, yeah. Barnabas, I was already promised with currency that I'm, I'm not allowed to sing the Angela Anaconda theme anymore. With real currency. Ruthie paid me 100 real bits, uh, one real dollar, to never sing the Angela Anaconda theme again. So I would have to be overpowered monetarily in order to, to break that. That's just the rules, baby. Frotoon. 
Is it's... Jedi Fallen Order difficult to learn? I'm, I'm debating whether I want to buy that digitally. Uh, I need, I need help. I need help. Just so you know, it's Fruitune, because I thought it was Fruitune for like the first two months. Oh, Fruitune. Give me some help here. Yeah. Give me strength. Give me strength. Sora's talking to Jesus Christ during that, right? When he says yes. that? Yeah, I thought so. Oh, yeah. He's expecting Jesus, but he always gets Disney characters. Give me strength. Oh, man, it's another Give fucking me. random animal. All of the summons are just random animals. Oh, I know. That's not true. Tinkerbell and Genie. All the summons you get from rocks, though, those are random animals. Die! See, it's these fucking seeds with, like, the angel stars and the invisibles. They get you. What's the... Oh, it's Hades at the end of this one, and then... Um, Rock Titan at the end of that, the one after. God, I still have 20 seeds. Well, I'm... I'm well into this set here, but... Whew! Daddy, uh, what about Pike scene? Mmm. The Pike scene in The Walking Dead, or the comparative Pike scene in uh, Kenobi? Oh, here's Hades. That one. The, the latter. I, I can't. I can't comment on it because I don't know it. I also don't want to. What? Oh. That's four, baby. That's four. That's not crack a Rudy. Uh, All right, I'm gonna keep trying. Fuck. I can't believe- Hades just comboed me there. What about Walking Dead? The I Walking see. Dead Pike scene? You don't like that at all. You hate that. It stuck with you. As someone who did not watch the show at all, it stuck with you, hardcore. Ooh. Should I use Blizzard on my hotkey instead? Uh-oh. Okay, I got 101 bits. Sorry, Ruthie. Um... My name is Angela. Hey, hello. Welcome to my very own show. I don't know the rest of the words. That's as far as I can do, but I hope that uh, that pleases you. Look at that. I, I made 201 cents today off of Angela Anaconda. And it's about goddamn time I got paid back for that shitty show. I'm sorry you had to hear that, Kiwi. Can I request a impression even though I can't do the thing right now. I guess. I want to hear Power Cell guy. Here's another Power Cell. There you go. Thank you. Yeah. Power Cell guy from Jack and Daxter. What am I? You sounded so mad. <laughs> Listen, I don't like when the, the the economy is disrupted, that's all. Oh! Carly, thank you for gifting uh, your 24th sub to Ascending Ascension. With the little sad crying face. Oh no. Oh no. He's so sad. It's about damn time. What Ruthie. What is Greeny the Goblin's sound? Greeny's. Oh, his name is Corin, so it's Corin from Smash Bros. Oh, uh, right, right. right. Corin. Yeah. Um, and then Knobel is for Knobel's theme park. Mm. And Edisburg. Is it Edisburg or Edisburg? Elysburg. What? Yeah. Oh, it's not a D, it's an L, isn't it? Yes. Why did I think it was Edisburg? That's weird. I don't know. That's trash, dude. I'm thinking of the ice cream. <laughs> I have ice cream on the brain. The Edie's Eddie's ice cream? You know what I'm talking about? Oh? No. Two dollars from Omni. Hear me out. Disrespectfully, don't sing that again. Okay. Alright, fair enough. I've made a lot of money on Angela Anaconda today. Like four whole dollars. When Sora Ooh, says... Somebody's move. Go ahead. Sorry, when Sora says give me strength, he's talking about the Xemnas Jesus statue in Dream Chop Distance. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's true. The game where I ignore it, I ignore the key kids? Yeah, the very same. Oh, uh, Ruthie, I was just saying that uh, I'm sorry about the Angela Anaconda thing, but you were outbid, so... Anyway, what were you saying, Kiwi? Uh, somebody's moved up the rankings in the, oh. uh, in the step challenge. 
Oh, a competitor against you? I mean, they've not moved past me. Oh, okay. They're not even close, but they're just like... They've been talking a lot of shit. Oh, that's scary. They've moved into second place now, Ooh. so... Now you really gotta re-blister your blisters. Yep. You're fucked, Here dude. Here come the blisters, Your baby. feet are done. Worth it. Yeah. If it's for cash, yeah. If it gets to the last day and I'm losing, I'm just like walk the entire day. <laughs> dude, it's for a cash prize. I want fucking cash, dude. How often do you get a cash prize? Not often. I've gotten like one cash prize in my life. The only way I make cash is by selling my fingernails. Yeah, <laughs> fingernails for cash.com. <laughs> I know that most people in the chat probably don't like Family Guy, but uh, I usually find it amusing. I'm sorry. Re especially your blisters. Especially like the earlier, early to mid Family Guy. It tickled me. Um, I don't think it's hilarious. It's not like the funniest thing on earth, but I think people are. Too, I think people are too hard on Seth MacFarlane. Would you agree with me on that? Yeah. Sorry, I'm sorry. I think a lot of people think, uh, oh, 6.90 money, baby, from Nacho Man Sandy Mavage. I don't know what it is, but do the thing that Ruthie wanted since he was outbid. Ruthie wanted me to not do something, Nachos. Ruthie wants me to never sing the Angela Anaconda song again. Um, yeah, like, old family guy, like, fucking, like, early 2000, I guess, you know, right around pre- and post-cancellation. Like... And I think people think Seth MacFarlane is like a douche, but and maybe he's a bit pretentious, but like he's a pretty talented guy. Um, I don't know. I uh, I don't feel bad having this one controversial opinion. Like if you like stupid voices and just like dumb humor, and not all of like it is like do. that, but me and Kiwi love that kind of shit. Like we just love stupid voices. Um, so we really do. Sorry. Yeah. I have no shit. By our I king. I love dumb voices and shit. I mean, that's my that's no. my favorite thing. We fucking love dumb voices. <laughs> and you, you say what you will about Family Guy, but at least it didn't promote this fucking false equivalency bullshit that South Park promoted. That's right. Like, South Park might be the smarter show, but I think, uh, I think it's overall been more detrimental to society than Family Guy. Like I genuinely think in my in my bones of bones that South Park raised like a second Gen X of like apathetic assholes who think that like giant douche and turd sandwich is like the be all end all of political discourse, you know? Like I promise you that fucking show is responsible for people like not voting because they think that like one side is just as bad as the other. When it's so clearly a fucking exaggeration. So like, I don't think Family Guy ever, like, poisoned the well in the way that South Park did. Because, like, Matt and Trey are, like... Like, they did Book of Mormon. Good on them. But, like, are they not, like, weird libertarian weirdos? I have not watched the Orville. I can't believe I'm doing this fucking... I died to Hades. I can't believe that. Most of the shit that I like in Book of Mormon, I think, comes from Robert Lopez. <laughs> The third person involved in that. Ah. Uh, that's fair. Like, I actually don't really give a rat's ass about, Thunder. like, the book of the Book of Mormon. Like, right. the script of it. Like, I want the songs. You like the songs, yeah. Mostly the songs that, like, aren't, like, asshole songs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like know. you and me, but mostly me. That's our fucking theme song. I never watched The Simpsons, so I can't really, uh, can't really comment on that. Book of Mormon mid key racist. It is mid key racist. As I are the Mormons. Um. See, but Kiwi and I are not middle aged men or edge lords. Um, and we definitely find a lot of, uh, not a lot of, but like, you know, we find our fair share of Family Guy amusing. Again, we just love when people say the same thing over and over or make stupid voices. 
then that's like a lot of it, <laughs> you know. We're not like laughing at like, you know, the fucking edgy stuff, really. Like, it's just sort of background noise. I'm not saying it's a fucking TV show to live by. I'm just saying sometimes the characters say funny things and do funny things to each other. And sometimes it's just it's just that simple. Sometimes it ain't that deep. Is it my favorite yeah, like show on earth? No. Um I got in trouble for saying this, but I I don't think anyone's arguing that it's high art, you know? And that's okay. Hi, Capitan, Capitan Blitz. Um, tried applying the 1992 video to KH2. Realized you lose every Disney World except Space Paranoids and Timeless River slash Disney Castle. So you're saying, what if KH2? What if KH2 was the first game and it came out in '92? Um, yeah, because you lose. Yeah, you have no Mulan. You have no Hercules. No Beauty and the Beast. No, you would have Beauty and the Beast. It was '91, but we we cut it from Mars. Um, you have no Lion King, you have no Pirates, no Little Mermaid. No, you do have Little Mermaid. Um, so you wouldn't, you wouldn't lose Little Mermaid in that exercise. Because 89 is close enough that I think it's fair. That's a fair game. Um, um... Sorry, what were we talking about anyway? The South Park. Oh, right, right, right. You know, I, it's like, I, I feel like people are, are just so, uh, you know, if one thing makes one joke they don't agree with, then they're like going to sort off of it for the rest of their, their lives. It's like, I don't think saying that I occasionally find the show amusing is like a fucking ringing endorsement of everything the show's ever done, you know? Um... Do people not like Big Mouth? I hear about it, but I don't know what the general consensus is on that. All I know is that, like, most high art humor is not as funny to me as for Wells Black <laughs> Again. Just the fucking voice. Yeah, I just the voice. The voice could be saying anything. We just love voices. And also, uh... I, I'm away from the computer again, so I okay. said it, but like, whoever said about like, you know, the American adult cartoons are like the lowest form of humor, like that's kind of what I operate on, so that's yeah. probably why. Like, sometimes like, I, am, I just want to laugh at stupid humor. shit, yeah, like, I love stupid shit. You think South Park is less cynical than Family Guy? I think Family Guy can be nihilist in terms of its character interactions, but not in its like, show philosophy. Like, I cannot be... Like, South Park is, like, the fucking most nihilistic cartoon I've ever seen. Um, it's a shame that <laughs> that, J that James Woods gets to uh, gets to guest, uh, guest star in so many Family Guy episodes, speaking of. Um, <coughs> I don't know, like, you can't tell me that, like, that Family Guy has, like, influenced political discourse in the way that South Park has. I just, I can't buy that. I, I just met people my age who, like, use the phrase, like, oh, Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton, that's, like, giant douche and turd sandwich. Like, yeah, I guess if you really wanted to be, like, fucking reductionist about it, but one is clearly superior. Yeah, um, I'd rather hang out with a douche than a turd eat sandwich. a turd sandwich. Yeah, sure, of course. <coughs> I mean, yeah, obviously, a giant douche. If I, if I were actually voting between a giant douche and a turd sandwich... I'd vote for the giant douche for sure. Um, by the way, Pat, last stream I misread the quote, a good gun is better than sex, as a good pun is better than sex. Is it bad that I agree with the latter sentiment? Listen, it depends on what you're into. Um, I'm not a huge pun guy, but it depends on what, what the pun is, I guess. I would disagree with both premises, but that's okay. All right, let's not fuck this up. Um, I'm gonna do an Aroga. Somebody would be like pretty hard pressed to convince me that like anything is is better than sex. <laughs> it's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> uh, like, I don't know. Like, it's one of like those. With, like a. 
You could present me with like a whole scenario that like might be, but just like a single activity or something like yeah, that. Like, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I mean, it really is one of those, like, wow, this sure is the human experience. You know, it's hard to yeah, beat. Yeah, like, I'd, I'd have to, like, hear it. Right. For me to be convinced otherwise. You, you need you the know? case to be made. Like, if somebody presented, like, you know, you're hanging out, like, by, like, some kind of body of water. It's an outdoor bar. You're just kind of chilling. Some live music is happening. <laughs> like... I don't know, like, that I could probably say is, like, yeah, I'd rather do that, like, <laughs> in a vacuum, but, like, yeah. you gotta do so many things and combine so right. many different elements to Versus even one match thing. up to, yeah. Sure, sure. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a tough sell, to be, to be sure. Just wanted to let you know that the same people who were just roasting us for liking Family Guy... Mm. are now talking about how they like bad puns. Right. Yeah, no, it's, uh... <laughs> because it's not edgy. Like, uh, there's, uh, you know, people... If if something is edgy one time, or even most of the time, um, that, it, like, you know, you throw the baby out with the bathwater, you know? People don't like Edge. Edge is out. Edge was in back in the, uh, the early 2010s, you know, the 2000s. But Edge is out. We are, we're in the counter-Edge uh, time frame now. Not you, Barnabas. No, yeah. And, like, you know, there have been harmful jokes made on all of the shows that we've discussed. Um, so, nothing is a, a perfect black and white scenario here. Anything that can be described as better than sex can be dramatically enhanced by adding sex to it. <laughs> <him. laughs> I just, uh, the, the whole thing that started this was the guy that said... A good gun is better than sex. Like, I don't know if... Fuck! <sighs> I don't I know... Love, I love the idea of just like, yeah, I like cheese better than sex. But have you tried sex with cheese? <laughs> sex with cheese on it? Mm. Uh, I was gonna say, he said that a good gun is better than sex. Like, I don't know if the best gun times multiple times like the best gun 20 times i don't think is better than sex once it's a fucking gun who gives a shit yeah whatever we're on attempt five now was that four no that was five that was five deaths right i don't know if anyone who was around for the beginning of this is still here i'm just fucking blowing it it's pathetic thanks Allie. Five more times? I hope not. Music is better than sex? That's but a pretty good argument. With music? Yeah, that's true. I mean, having to live without one, music is really Cheese good. sounds nasty. Cheese is not nasty. No. Cheese is fantastic. Cage one or sex? I mean, I've I've played KH1 enough that I think I've, I get it. I, I think I could... I'm not done with sex yet, so... You know. <laughs> I've made a lot of content about KH1. I've really gotten uh, my money's worth of the original $50 purchase. So, um, you know. Uh, I hate to say it, but... <laughs> What'd you ask me, Gavaka? Peace isn't gross. Oh, cheese is not gross, no. I don't think cheese yes, is gross. Cheese is the best. You asked for nachos, you, you asked for my numbers? I don't know what you're talking about. Well nachos would have to know, he's nachos. Yeah. It's the greatest moment of his life. What numbers did you ask me for? Man, I could really go for some fucking nachos right yeah? now. I could go for that ice cream that I said I was gonna have a long time ago. What if KH one was removed from history and people's consciousness? That'd be bad. Oh, how to make the... I don't know. I've never done it myself. I, uh... Best cheese? Well, can you give me five options? Because there's so many cheeses. Oh, Kiwi, we should play that, uh... You know, like, name that tune? Uh-huh. I, uh... It's fun to play that, but with, like, just, like... Like, uh... Items in a group. Like, how many cheeses can you name? It's like, I can mm -hmm. name eight cheeses. And you go, oh, I can name nine cheeses. And you go, alright, well, name that mm -hmm. cheese. 
Uh, how yeah. many how many cheeses do you think you could name? Without mm. looking at the chat, I'm not looking at the chat. Like I think I could name probably seven cheeses. I could probably name eight cheeses. Uh, I could name nine cheeses. You know what? Give me ten cheeses. Mmm. I think I might be able to name eleven cheeses. Name those cheeses, bitch. <laughs> Fuck. I was hoping that you'd call my bluff and you go twelve. Nope. Um, okay. So, eleven cheeses. Yep. You got, uh, cheddar. Yeah. Um, do you count, does American count as a cheese? Yes. There's, okay, American. Um, Swiss. Um, yep. I can't look at chat. No chat. Mozzarella. Yep. <coughs> Brie. Yep. That's five. Uh, um, can I say, like, Cheddar Jack or, like, Monterey Jack? Monterey Jack. Okay. Six. Gorgonzola. Nice. Uh, that was a pool for sure. Parmesan, does that count? Yep. That's uh, eight. Um, uh, oh, fuck me. Name more cheeses, you idiot. Swiss. I got that. I got cheddar, mozzarella. Uh, oh, fuck. I thought I could get at least ten. I can't even get nine. I'm looking at letters on my keyboard. Uh, violin, thank you for the raid, dude. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, Kiwi challenged me to <laughs> name... <laughs> yeah, I've, I've been challenged to name 11 cheeses. Uh, and I'm having trouble. Uh, I'm at eight cheeses. Uh, provolone. Mm -hmm. Nine. Um, Havarti, that's ten. And then... Uh, you got this, champ. Um, fucking, I think there's one of the B that I'm missing. I already got Brie. He, he did say Brie, Carl. Yeah, I did say Brie. Um, mm, did I fuck this? Can I get an eleventh cheese at the eleventh hour? If there was a timer, I would have been fucked. One more cheese. One, one more, more cheese. cheese. One, one more, more cheese. cheese. <laughs> Pat getting raided while desperately probing his mind for cheese. Come on, I just need that 11th cheese. Fuck! You're pathetic. Why can't I think of any more cheeses? <laughs> just starts talking shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking disgrace. Cheese, cheese. What, what words come before cheese? Brie cheese, Swiss cheese, American cheese. I give up. Wow. Oh, goat cheese, blue cheese, cream cheese, feta cheese. I said Gouda. Did I not say Gouda? I think I said Gouda. Oh, I, I fucking thought I had you. I thought I could do it. 30 people left. 30 people came in from that raid and then left immediately. But I appreciate it anyway, Violin. I did say Gorgonzola. <coughs> um... I think I did better than a lot of people in the chat could. I think I could have gotten 12 cheeses, but I well, yeah. you failed. Well, yeah. I think people could have gotten fucking 15. I mean, I got close. You thought I was going to fail at, like, 9 cheeses. Yeah, yeah. Probably. That was a solid effort. Dude. I didn't say Gouda? Did I really not say Gouda? Because when did we were... Gula? I did not say Gula. That'd be the worst cheese. Anyway. I don't know why. Why did we even do that? Because you said name that tune. I said Oh, right. Right, right. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. I'm still pretty happy with my performance. I know everyone in the chat thinks I'm a fucking cheeseless idiot, but... Um... Gouda? I hardly know her. Oh! Ow! I guess my goal is going to be to 
beat the fucking Hades Cup on solo today. That's like my whole fucking three slash four hour endeavor. Ugh. Swiss cheese, the one with the holes, is called a, a mental cheese. Named after the air area it was created. What? <coughs> I don't know what that means. It's not from Switzerland? <laughs> Unless it's an area Switzerland in Switzerland. Is, Switzerland is ranked number one on my countries. Like of all Plus, countries? Yes. Huh. It's probably pretty good. Do you fuck with the uh, perpetual neutrality thing? Yes. Yeah. Ow. Die! God, my magic is so much. Alps. Oh, the Alps are there. Yeah. They got cheese and chocolate. Nobody <laughs> dies. Um, uh, got vodka. Could you, like, message Frosty and see if she knows how to do it? Because <laughs> I don't know how to do it either. I've never oh, had to run over. Frosty. Oh, my God. I thought that was the actual bite there. Good job, James Woods. I know you love being compared it. to James Woods. Did I waste my ether? Did I just waste my ether? Please tell me no. My god, my feet are so fucking gross. <laughs> Come look at your feet. For me, I don't think so. <laughs> Come on over. I don't think so. All yours, Frosty. <laughs> oh my god. Swiss cheese is a blanket term. It's not a single type of cheese. I did not know that. If I said cheesecake, would you have accepted that? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fuck. You fucked it up this time, Patty. Oh, nice, Patty. Oh, nice, Ron. I sneezed. I sneezed. Oh, no. The deer. It's gone. Oh, table. It's broken. <laughs> oh, my God. I just wanted bagels. <laughs> I just wanted bagels. All yours, Frosty. There we go, baby. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, right. God. Toe cheese. Heavens. My, my word. My word. A city. Oh, my good heavens. Um, I feel like I pissed a lot of people off today. Again, not because of the politics, but because of Family Guy and cheese. <laughs> Oh, you piss the bad pun people off because you like Family Guy? Yeah. I don't even... <laughs> I wouldn't even put Family Guy in, like, my top ten shows of all time. I would. You would? Yeah. <coughs> That's because you haven't seen Mr. No, Robot yet. I have not done that list in a while. Yeah. I've seen more shows since the last time I probably would have done such an exercise. Sure, so sure. Know, but... All right, let's not die to fucking Hades again. Kingdom's this is gonna Oracle take forever. Really wants me to pay attention to their feet. Yeah. Yes. Are we doing a feet swap? They're uh, trying to make me um, uh, just pay attention to their feet while I'm bitching about mine. Oh man. That's it's the feet Olympics now. All right, I'll figure it out, Vodka. Thank you for your service. I, I need a reminder. I'm on five deaths, correct? Yeah. Yeah. Fuck you, Hades. I'm still on his purple bar. Fuck. Ugh. I, I can't oh, believe. I'm on his invisible bar still. Barnabas said that choosing one there we of the go. chooses of the options is like choosing between a douche and a turd sandwich. Oh no, we're br bringing it all back now. Did I not say Colby Jack? I'm gonna be mad if I didn't say <coughs> say Colby Jack. Man, imagine not having voted for Hillary in 2016. It's a bad luck. 
This is my sixth try. So five deaths, though. Six tries. But what was the agreement? Also, what's the poll right now? What's the best cheese? Oh. Um, my tries? Okay. So this is my sixth try. How, oh man, I'm gonna really have to Google it because I have no idea how it works. I should know how these these things work better, considering it's my channel. Ow! Take that! Take that! Are you having fun yet? All yours, Frosty. All yours, Frosty. Fuck you. I wonder if I can just can I. You can't ground combo Haze even if you wanted to. It doesn't let you. Oh wait, maybe I can. Because it targets his upper torso, so it's like, really, it, like, it gravitates Sora to doing air combos. Yeah, like, I can't fucking do it. It wants me to air combo him, and my air combos are weaker. Because I don't have the magic-based finisher on them. I ate cereal for dinner tonight. Oh yeah? What kind? I'm proud of it. Are you going to disclose what kind? No. Okay, that's fair. I know it was Grape Nuts now, though. Oh! Oh no! Oh my god! Ah! Jesus Christ. Um... If someone says they had cereal but won't disclose what it is, I just assume that they had Grape Nuts. Shout out to Frosty's husband. Rare Nuts. Rare Nuts. Kellogg's Rare it was, Nuts. <laughs> it was in the Fruity Pebble family, Garland. Okay. Would you count trash. would you count Rice Krispies to be in the Fruity Pebble family? No. I wouldn't either, but I thought maybe there was an argument to be made. I don't really like no, Rice Krispies. No, it was uh it was Cocoa Pebbles. Oh, okay. So wait, 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 wait. I feel like if Cocoa I guess if it's Fruity Pebbles, then that means it's Oh, hi Hades. He's just starting to get warmed up. Saying that a lot now. Um, if Cocoa Pebbles weren't called Cocoa Pebbles, I wouldn't say they're in the Fruity Pebbles family. I feel like I was. I feel like I was misled. Because are aren't Rice Krispies also just rice-based cereal like Fruity Pebbles? Like there's corn-based cereal. Thing. Okay. All right. I had Cocoa Pebbles for breakfast, too. I am complete fucking trash. Beef, beef fast and dinner Cocoa Pebbles? Yeah. That's pretty solid. There are worse things to have both for breakfast and dinner. Well, listen, I want to get through that before I get to my healthy cereals. Plus, I've been doing a lot mm. of walking. So yeah, like, you've earned it. To treat myself yeah. You've treat earned yourself, it. we. A wild card. <laughs> a wild pebble. You've earned it. Thanks, Luxord. 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 Shut up with that garbage. Is, who are you? Luxord. Luxord. Ah, uh, Allie, you haven't had cereal in literal years. That's really sad. I bought tricks the other day that I've been meaning to get to. Now that they're back to being fruit shapes and not just those boring balls, are you kidding me? I gotta get my fill before they make a terrible decision again. All right, Hades, come on, it's the H-ster. You're almost done, bucko. And then I just got 10 seeds left. It ends with the Rock Titan, that's not even... All right, fucking finally. Okay. That sure is the power of the Keyblade, Sora. Oh, I also love Trix Yogurt. I also love Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Yeah, that is only... CTC is definitely a top three cereal for me. Um, CTC, Fruity Pebbles, uh, Frosted Flakes. That's probably my tentative top three in some order. I think CTC is probably the tentative number one. But... I think you can just squeeze Fruit Loops in as like, uh, that's probably top five. Yeah. Reese's Puffs, uh, I don't know. I go through phases with Reese's Puffs. 
<clears throat> yep, Special K does slap. Those are my other two options. Oh, for sure, Gavaka. You got to uh, eat the, the yogurts and halves. The Trix yogurt. As the rabbit intended. So right now we're still on the sixth try. See, Lucky Charms, I kind of fell out of Lucky Charms. Um, did I hiccup? I don't even remember. You know what? Let's get rid of the uh, little guys first. Actually, let's Aroga. Let's get the wizards now. My, my order of cereal operations for the next few days is going to be get through the Cocoa Pebbles. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to start on the Strawberry Special K. Okay. And then I get Fruit and Yogurt Special K for getting through the other two. That sounds delicious, actually. Fruit and Yogurt Special K, like, again, that's another thing that just kicks my dick off. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It like, does sound dick-kickable. I would let fruit and yogurt special K shoot me in the face. Yeah. That's so romantic. Ah, uh, isn't it romantic? I would let this fruit and yogurt special K shoot me in the face. <laughs> and kick my dick off. Yeah. My dick fell off! Oh no! My dick! It fell off! Wow, wait, that's poetic. Yeah. Come on, Stealth Sneak. Uh, do you remember back in the day we said that we'd never be able to do like a team up uh, yes. run through of KH1 because like it would just evolve into stupid shit? Yeah. That's this. We've actually discussed that on stream before, how we thought that. And, oh. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. God. This is not the first time we've, uh, we've rebuked that premise. Yep. We'd be talking about, like, behemoths fucking each other and stuff. <laughs> right. Because we asked, uh, we, we wondered, like, how do the Heartless reproduce? Did the behemoths just fuck? Did they fuck, um, for reproductive for purposes or just for pledge? Yeah. I think they fuck for pledge. I think so. I mean, it's, it's an interesting question. Like, are Heartless all born of darkness or, uh, can two shadows fall in love? Can love like bloom even on the battlefield? I like to think they could fall in love, yeah. Just because they're heartless doesn't mean they're heartless, you know. Um, yeah. Totes for pledge, yeah. That's the power of the Keyblade! Nobody's fuck. Oh? Nobody's fuck for sure. I think that's all they do. Anytime you're not seeing a nobody and you're not fighting one, they're probably fucking. Oh, they're just smashing yeah. right now. Nobodies are constantly just railing each other. Um, what's one more singular death? We'll see. I'll see what I can do. Oh, you might get one. Can love bloom on the battlefield? I think so. I think for sure. Otacon was right. Well, Otacon just asked. I don't know if... Snake said yes, though, didn't he? I think Snake said that uh, Love can bloom on the battlefield. Oh my god. The god? Okay, hold on one second. Yeah. Go ahead. Um, thanks for saying that, Bad Rune Man, sir. I get that a lot. Why do I get no MP for hitting this fucker? Like, look at my little yellow MP bar. Why is... I get, I get way more for getting hit. I wish I could get MP not just for getting hit, but also for talking shit. Um, just finished eating cereal. God, cereal is, is having a big moment in the sun tonight. That's crazy. Yo, I think I'm gonna shade the guy who is talking shit. Who? Uh, on the step challenge on Instagram. Oh, okay. Because he was talking shit on Instagram before it even started, so, like, I think I'm about to clap back here. No, yeah, you've earned it. 
You've earned it. I mean, if the blisters are anything to go by, you've earned it. Shade me, daddy. <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. Come on, you fucking wizard. Come on! Oh, fuck off. Die. <laughs> I just learned Slapshot. Oh, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. Why don't you go fuck yourself, Charlie Brown? Wow. It's my favorite special. Oh! God, Arrow is so good. It is so powerful with my magic stats. It's like way better than my Keyblade. I don't need a weapon. Aroga is my power. Die, Defender. I honestly feel like this run has been more difficult than my level 1 run. Although I'm doing a lot of optional shit, so I don't know, but... Yo. Yo. You wanna know the best part about the, uh... About the step challenge? Hmm. We have to pick, like, a little avatar for ourselves. Uh-huh. And just to troll Oh, everybody. that's what you sent me. Yes. You picked Peter Pan. <laughs> Peter Pan's HUD. <laughs> yeah. I was wondering what that was. Yep. I was like, it looks like a Kahoot leaderboard. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's a great pick. Peter Pan's I think HUD like icon. Very, I think it's like very insulting to be like, yeah. the ultimate little shit is above all of you people. Oh, for sure. What's so mid? Oh, arrow in KH3. Um, I don't know. Magic in general in KH3 is kind of like I love. Uh, I love being able to move while you use it, but the spells themselves, like, I love sliding on the uh, the Blizzard thing. That's really cool. Ow! But other than that, like, I'm not a huge Magic guy in KH3. I like it a lot in one, you know? Boom! Oh, fuck this. Oh man, I do not like Angel Stars. Gabaka, I'm almost done. If you could hang on until I'm done with this cup. It'll be my favorite mod, even though you're always so rude to me. I just gotta do this, and then uh, Rock Titan. And then you can give the people the points that they deserve. Although, I, I it sounds like some someone said that only one person voted for five to six tries, so... They get all the points. You literally can't?! Oh my god. Alright, that's fine. Well, you, you lost your chance, though. Looks like him mm, 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 is still my favorite mod. Why are these called angel stars? Isn't that a little peaceful for a heartless? I guess it's just because of the wings. Meh. Meh. I agree, though. It's deceptively um, pleasant sounding. Yeah. You're, uh... You're mostly agreeing with Castle Oathkeeper. What's that? That is uh, one of your. Uh, no, I know. I know the person. I'm saying, what am I agreeing with? Oh, uh, about the the angel stars. Oh, a weird name for the. Yeah, for sure. For straight out of hell. Yeah, I mean they're hell beasts for sure. Maybe that's part of the irony. Yeah. Cheeky bastards. You see, it's ironic. Don't you think? You see, her poopsies are toast. You see. An equation that uh, that really elucidates the uh, elimination of poopsies. God, that fucking round is eternal. 
Eternal. Eternal. All right, we made it to Rock Titan. This is supposed to be just yeah, a victory lap. Is mental. Oh God, shut up! Please no. Stop. I love, by the way, in the uh, character bracket when I keep making the uh, the jokes about Demix being the master of masters. At one point, you just go stop. <laughs> but it's like it's like a really pleasant <laughs> stop. Man, I hate that. You don't like it? No. Oh, Demix and the master of masters. Master masters. Yeah. That's like the one thing that I really don't want to. Ask. Oh, I know. But I would. Uh, uh I'm like. 30 30 percent on it right now this is try six correct like 30 percent it'd be okay no i'm saying 30 percent i think it's gonna happen oh my god yeah yeah but you also don't think that princess and the frog and tiana is gonna be one of the uh princess the i'm hard, i'm though. also 30 percent on that yeah so i don't know how much i should listen to you I'm not saying you should. I'm not saying anybody should. I'm just saying that's where I'm at. I think a lot of. I'm not saying you're doing this. I think a lot of people think me stating my opinion uh, equates to me requesting that people share it. Mm. And that's never the case. I just, I'm just giving you a window into my own stupid brain. That's part of the uh, part of the whole creator to audience thing. Is just like here's what my stupid brain's up to. Yeah. Ho ha ho! I could die if I'm not careful. If I don't have a Roga up, like I, it's dangerous. This guy hits hard if I'm not paying attention. Ho ha ho ha ho ha ho! Okay, bye, Sora. See, like if that landed on me and my Roga ran out, I, that might have been a death. Holy fuck! Wow! Wow! I'm very squishy. Why is it so important that you beat this for God Vodka? Like, what's the time? Uh, God Vodka wants to go to bed, and I don't know how to uh, deliver the points that people have bet on for my uh, amount of attempts on this. People bet on uh, how uh, how well I would do, and I irresponsibly don't know how to divvy out the points when the uh, result is met. But God Vodka does know, and she wants to go to sleep. Because she wakes up very early. Because she's teaching the youth. Uh. Oof! We're uh. almost done, Gavaka. We're almost done. I promise. I promise. Just gotta keep doing these combos, baby. Uh. There we go. Where did the idea Ooh. that like they're gonna drop the new seven hundred stuff from? They're gonna drop it? I think people are just being pessimistic that it's like a thread that they're gonna not continue. Like, I got to save the queen. I can't think of another time in Kingdom Hearts where they just like set something up like that and then we're just like, up oh, and we're not finishing it. Like, yeah, is there like an obvious example of that happening that I just like can't remember or something? I struggled to... Yeah, six attempts is where we ended, Gavaka. Yeah, I struggled to think of something where it's like, here's a thread that we dropped. Um, I'm sure there's, like, small things. Like, you want to consider, like, King Triton talking about, like, the fucking Keyblade wielders. Like, is that a thread that they dropped? No. Yeah, I don't I'm think so either. I'm talking about, like, a big thing. Like, a like big core concept. Dust, right. And they're just like, yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Gavaka. And good night to you as well. Yeah, no, I think that's mostly bullshit. Um, I also love this community. It's my favorite one. Um, oh, you're right, Vaka. We do owe you a weapons bracket. Or a weapons tier list. Whatever we choose to do. What do I think is... I think the, the idea that people think that they're going to drop the new Seven Hearts is BS. Like, I don't know where people are getting that from. Um, this whole stream was fucking Hades Cup solo. But what can you do? Um... All right, we're gonna we're gonna wrap it up though. Uh, let me do my plugs here, and thank you all for stopping in and really just sparing the storm when it comes to all of our different conversations here. Twitter, Discord, Patreon, and new video dropping tomorrow, five six ish. 
one of those hours it'll come out. It's about 10 minutes. It's about uh, Old Cage, One Myth. Hopefully you find it interesting. Um, we'll be back uh, Saturday, 4 p.m. I'm sorry, I'm very burpy slash hiccupy. Um, we have uh, some Dream Eaters Kahoot by Kamori, as well as Epic Mickey will be continuing. Also, yes, Hunter Does Games. Happy birthday tomorrow. Just a couple of hours until Hunter Does Games' birthday. So, happy birthday, Hunter. Um, yeah, 4 p.m. Uh, Dream Eater Kahoot, Epic Mickey on Saturday. Um, this will probably return Tuesday at 6. Um, and... I think that's it. Kiwi, you have any words? Um... Uh, I don't have anything massive. Uh, just uh, be safe out there, kids. You yeah. know. And we're gonna uh, raid Frosty. It's a big, scary world, and uh, yeah, good luck. We're gonna raid Frosty, one of my longtime mods and patrons, and just overall a great person. So say hi to Frosty. Um, hit a Jabib. Give her a follow. She's playing Cage Two right now. So let's do that. And then until next time. Saturday at 4. Be safe, be kind, be courteous. Bye-bye. Raid.